Touch the baby. You people are scared to. Uh, so, who kept the baby? You just saw the baby here? And all of you grown ups are just looking at the baby in a dustbin with, with this whole stench here? Come on, excuse me. Huh? So, nobody saw who dropped this baby? Nobody saw. Nobody saw. People can be very callous. People can be callous. How could somebody give birth to a beautiful baby like this and abandon her? How could? Oh, what has life turned to in this our country? Eh? You know what? I'm going to take this baby to, to the station. Right? I'll take her to the station and then um, I'll report this case officially. So, and then we we'll arrange how to take care of her. I can't leave this baby here and, and walk away. No, I cannot. You know, hmm? yes, sir. Yeah, but before then, I have to show evidence of this. I'm a police officer, so we always work with evidence hmm? Hmm. and exhibit. Um, all right, so I have to snap the baby at the dustbin. And uh, you people too. No, why not? Why not? Why not? You are here. You are here. Come on, no, 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 no. You must do it. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm actually having um, a selfie of myself and you people. Look at it. All right, so we're all here doing this, eh? And the baby too. All right. Okay. So I'm taking the baby to the police. Don't don't worry. The baby will be safe. Hmm? All right, baby. Oh, she's so beautiful. Oh, yeah. Wow. All right. So you can go to your separate house. I'm taking the baby to the police station. How about which police station you carry and they go? Police station. Metro police station. Okay. I'm going back to my metro. You don't know metro police station? You don't know? Who was asking? You want to come along with me? Come along. I don't want to come. So what were you asking? I don't follow you. I will not trust you. I will not trust you. I will follow you. My brother, I say I see him today. <laughs> people are wicked. So, yes, people can actually dump their baby in a dustbin. We have seen worse cases here. Mm, far worse cases. You know, girls flushing their babies down the drain and what? all kinds of things. What? Yes, it happens everywhere. My main concern is to make sure that the baby is safe and sound, you know, and uh, has a home. Okay? Mm. You, need to, you needed to have seen people gather, snapping photographs, doing video, and uh, uploading on the internet. You can imagine that. How could? Instead of assisting the poor baby. It's, it's not right at all, it's not right. Sir, you are a good man. I mean, it's people like you, we need a position of leadership in this country. Exactly. Yes. Well, it's, that, that's what it takes to be a good citizen. That's, yeah. why, we're, that's why we're police officers. Yes, yes. We yes. must lead by example. Example, yes. <laughs> all right. That's all right. Mm. This file is file, uh, file. Yes, sir. No, it's uh, very, very important. Uh, I have to go now. You know, I was on my way. I had already signed up before I saw this. I had to come back. Okay, sir. Mm -hmm. Okay, sir. Have a nice day. Okay, sir. Okay, take care, sir. Yes, sir.
Our baby. I don't understand. Um, on my way back from office, I saw people gathered at, uh, at a dustbin and uh, they were looking at this girl. Somebody abandoned this baby at a dustbin. So I took the baby. The girl, <laughs> I brought her home. Are you serious? Yes. <laughs> Who was this world turning into? Business? I wonder. People were busy snapping photos, they are taking videos and be posting all, all over the place instead of helping the baby. Can you imagine? So I chased all of them out and then I, I carried the baby. Mm. Don't you think this is risky? No, 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 no. I, I, I took the baby back to my office at the station. So I, I, I incidented the case and then put up a, a short agreement that uh, the baby is in my custody. So, so we're, we're safe. No, 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 no. Honey, I'm not comfortable with this. Don't you think you should take this baby to the motherless baby soon? I, I thought about that too, but uh, I felt there's no, there's no need. You know, we have all it takes to take care of this baby, so why take her to motherless baby so Besides, I have evidence of this whole incident. Look, look at this, man. Look. I snapped the whole situation. Look at it. All the people gathered, the crowd, the dustbin. You know, and then, and then, so even, even video, look at this one, the video of the whole incident, when the baby was at the dustbin. Honey, what if something happens to this phone tomorrow? I'm not praying for anything bad to happen, but you know anything can happen at any time. And if anything happens to this phone, the whole information will be lost. What do we do then? I understand you perfectly well, and I have thought about it. You know what? Immediately after now, I'll change and go to the photo studio. There they will print out these photographs. I'll put them in a file and keep them somewhere for the future. With that, there's no worry at all. It's concrete evidence anytime, any day. I pick this baby from the uh, dustbin and the baby is under my custody. And my beautiful wife is taking care of her. Hmm? So honey, there's nothing to worry about, absolutely not, okay? I was just worried about you, you know, whether you will accept the baby, that's all. But here you are, I mean, <laughs> you are with the baby already. <laughs> ah, I'm, so, I'm so excited. You know, at least I saved the baby. Honey, mm -hmm. I'm not comfortable with this, though. Ah. But I can't. Uh, let me go and give, feed this baby, then run her a good bath. Then later in the day, you take her to the hospital. Let's find out if she has contacted any disease. Oh, that's so nice of you. That's why I keep loving you. Ah, you're so kind-hearted. You're so caring. I'm so happy to hear that. Don't start with your romantic conversation, people. I'm not in that mood now. Uh, you have, have to be in the mood. Uh, you are. That is what you sign for. That is what you sign for. <laughs> Sweetheart, there is something very important I want us to discuss. Hmm? Um, I want you to promise me that you will see this new baby as your own child, as our own, even after you must have delivered our own biological child. Are you scared I would maltreat her tomorrow? No, I, I haven't said so, but um, I, I'm just trying to play safe, you know. Um, I just want to make assurance doubly sure, all right, uh -huh. um, so that um, we won't have stories that touch tomorrow. Hmm? I'm not doubting you, but I just want assurance. Hmm? Hmm? So, uh, on that basis, I want you to swear by this Bible that you will love and treat this baby as your own biological child. My love, do I really need to swear with the Bible? I promise I'll treat her right, like our own biological child. Are you sure? I'm very sure. 
Are you sure? I'm sure, my love. Take my word for it. You know the kind of things that happen these days, the kind of stories we hear, women beating up and even pouring hot water, pouring hot oil, even killing but children you know because they don't like belong that. to them. Well, you know I'm not like that. Yeah, no. It's, it's alright. It's alright. I take you by your words. Thank you. I take you by your Thank words. You. <laughs> I can't wait to have our own baby. Okay. <laughs> it might even be a boy. A boy? Hmm. That would be wonderful. <laughs> boy or girl, I'll be very happy. Really? Whichever. Yes. Okay. <laughs> they all gifts from God. <laughs> wow. Wow. You're such a one. That's why I love you so much. You're such a wonderful, special, kind-hearted woman. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Come on. I love you so much. Let me run along. Oh, okay. They're already calling me at the office. Eh? Okay. If there's any issue, you know what to do. Just give me a call. Alright? Okay, baby. Baby. Mm -hmm. Please come back on time, okay? Oh, definitely. You know, you have to take the baby to the hospital today. Sure. And, you know, I've not been feeling too well since last night. Oh, yeah. I told you, you know. Yeah. But yeah. I think I need to go to the hospital too. Okay. I, I, I think it's normal. We're getting very close. Hmm? What was the date the doctor gave us again? I think tomorrow or next. Sometimes you know the date is always correct. Of course, yeah, I understand. It's always uh, plus or minus. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so let me run along, okay? Alright, baby. Ah, no, not mm, baby. Mm. <laughs> I see you there. God. Congratulations. Your wife gave birth to a bouncing baby girl. Oh, thank God. <laughs> God is God. And then, you have a sister now? I'm so excited. <laughs> yeah. I'm so excited. Okay, okay. Um, can I see my wife and the baby now? Uh, I'm sorry. The baby is fine. But. Your wife didn't make it. What? I mean, she died after giving birth to the baby. No! 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 Don't tell me that! Don't tell me that, doctor! No, no, no! I'm sure you're lying. No, no, this is a prank, isn't it? Not? Isn't it? I'm not lying. I mean, she died as a result of seizure. I mean, only God knows why. God knows all. Don't you see how my wife died for real? Officer John, God is God. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't believe this. Take I don't believe this. Take tell me, tell me it's not true, please. Officer John, take hands. My wife Felicia died. God is God. Take my wife Felicia died. Take heart, oh, Officer God. John. Please sit down, sit down. Huh? <laughs> sorry, sorry. Oh, sorry. Sorry, Erica. Sorry, sorry. Hmm? Angel. Oh, my daughters. My beautiful daughters. Your mother has left us. Oh, she left us heartbroken. Sorry, Erica. Sorry, sorry, okay? I'm here. I'm here for you. Daddy's here for you, okay? Okay. 
one where I take care of both of you. I'll give you my best. Eh? Oh, my baby, eh? You grew up in love and unity, okay? As sisters. Right, eh? That is here. That is here. I'll give you everything you require. You understand me? Oh, Angel. There we go. There we go. I'll make sure you people are fine. Hmm? Both of you, I will give you all my love, all my time, all my energy, everything that I've got. Make sure you grow up happily, okay? Stop crying, baby. Stop crying. Okay, join your sister. Eh? Oh, sister's love. Sister's love, sister. Oh. Oh, what a beauty. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Mm -hmm. And the Erica, 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 and the Erica. You know what? Go and do the cooking. That's what we're supposed to do together. Let me wash the plates. No. So see how we're going to do it. Mm -hmm. Allow me to wash the dishes. Mm. When I'm done, mm. we'll cook together. Is that fine? Yes. And then we'll do our assignments together. Of course. Um, you help me solve my maths while I'll help you write your literature. Mm. Someone is trying to run away from logarithm of the table because I know it's very difficult for you to solve. But do not worry, my sister. We will solve the math together and we'll do the literature together. Because you know I am good with literature and mathematics. Mm. So you've got to learn. Someone should just ring praises on me. I mean, can I be called Chica Obi of our town? Okay, you are the Chica Obi of our town. Hey! <laughs> coming from you. I love I, you even I love more. you too. Papa! Papa! <laughs> Uh, once I'm done with this, I'll start cooking. That's all right. That's all right. I I like what I am seeing. Eh? Yeah, keep it up. I like the way you girls relate. That is very good. You're good girls, eh? Keep it up. All right. Let me quickly wash it. Okay. Let me just go and check the food on the fire. All right. Oh, you prepare the firewood. Let me start. Lovely sisters. Lovely 
They care for each other. Their love is super. Eric and one member. Eat your food. Eric will join you soon. Don't worry, I wish I was going to get water. She gets cold. Doesn't matter. I start eating. When she comes, she will join you. Erika! advantage of unity. If I see you prepare this food together and uh, it's wonderful. Oh. My parents don't know. She was not there. Sorry, I'm breaking the table manners. Eh? <laughs> Sorry. Eat your food. <laughs> why did you eat the meat? Why did you eat the meat? Why did you collect the meat? It's just one meat. 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 I can I can sacrifice mine for you. Who has given us meat? Let's share this one now. Share what? Come on, Angel. Um, Erica. Angel. Papa. I called for this special meeting between father and daughters to discuss a very important topic. We have discussed this thing before, but I want to re-emphasize it. Hmm? I want both of you to continue to love each other like you've been doing all along. It pleases my heart. Hmm? I don't ever want anything to come in between both of you. And I want you to watch each other's back. Be there for each other. Anytime, any day, anywhere. Okay? Papa, you have absolutely nothing to worry about. Erika and I have always loved each other. We have always been there for each other. And I promise you something, Papa. Nothing in this world, nothing can ever come between us. I'm so happy to hear this. Papa Angel is right. The bond we share is very strong. Very strong? Yes. Hmm, like super clear. <laughs> <laughs> I am so happy to hear this. So, so happy. Please make sure that going forward, there will be no complaints. You know, the usual young girls thing, eh, boyfriend, I say, well, boyfriend, I say, oh, this one, I say, well, this one, I say, oh, I say, well, I say, well, I say oh. whatever you need, I can afford, I'll provide them, okay? No quarrels, no complaints, okay? No problems, Papa. Uh, but, you know, we have not complained to you before, have we? No, no, mm -hmm. no, honestly, you have not. Mm -hmm. And I just want to make sure it doesn't happen. I just want to. Chai, mm -hmm. Papa, you're very funny. <laughs> Angel is my only sibling and my only sister. The bond we share is very strong that nobody can separate us. This gladdens my heart. <laughs> it really, really gladdens my heart. Mm -hmm. Thank you, I'll leave you. Mm -hmm. I just wanted to have the reassurance. Okay? Have a good time. All right. Let me, let me have some rest. And... Um, have dinner in the next uh, two hours. Okay? Yes. It will be ready by then. All right. Go and bring the window. Where did you keep it? Okay, I'll bring it. Do you know where you get it? Yes, of course. Bring it, bring it. I'll, I'll play you. Me, I'll win you. Hey, you. Wait now. 
Then they will start begging me very soon to pity for you. I'm begging me for 200 naira. What are you doing? Same money Papa gave us to fetch water with. That's what you're buying, uh, sweets. What will you tell Papa? No, we don't get to the bowl. I will tell the man that Papa said we should buy the water on credit. When he sees him, he will pay. No, that's Take. a lie now. That's a lie. That's not fair now. Are Papa you... did not say that. Why are you lying against Are you going to expose me to Papa? Eh? What if he sees Papa and says that he's going to worry? Everything is important. Take a seat now. Angel and Erica. Ah. How are you girls doing? We are fine. You did not come as promised. Sorry, I was busy with house chores, but I promised to come this evening. That's mm -hmm. what you always say. Anyways, don't bother coming. We'll see you in school tomorrow. Erika, you are so blunt. Are you saying I shouldn't visit you girls again? Yes. Yeah. I never said so. Did I say anything like that? You did not come. Don't worry. <laughs> Queen Erika. It's okay. I'll see you girls in school don't tomorrow. Don't worry. Go, go, go. We'll see you tomorrow. Are you pushing your friend? I'll see you See, see. I'm not happy about this. What was? About what you just did. Are you going to expose us to Papa? Not exposing us to Papa. When we get there now and the man refuses, what, what are we going to do? Just keep your mouth shut. I will handle it. We no, don't have go. even a drop of water in the house. I'm talking and you're raising your... Let's lick sweet first. I will not open this sweet until we get there first. We might return it. Don't open your bowl. We will not return it. Let's move. No, don't try to open that. And she pounced on you 
and did this to you? Papa, I didn't do anything. That girl is very troublesome. She's always looking for trouble. Everybody knows. Inspector John's daughter? Is it because I am retired? That idiot thinks I would watch her beat my sister up like this. That will never happen again. You see, this, this event that took place today will never ever happen again. Ah! Sorry, sorry. Oh. Sorry, sorry. This is pinning. We forgot, we forgot, Papa. Wait, what did you say? You did a fracture or something. No, 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 no. Don't worry. No, no, this is not a simple matter. Papa, I don't want you to stress. Angel, you are the one who. Just leave this for me. Leave it for me. Let her try it again. Let's try her also. Let's. let's... I guess I arrested immediately. Oh, no, 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 no. I guess I arrested him. Put her behind bars. You have me here. You seem to have forgotten that I have single boy. I would sort her out. You see, for this thing that she has done, she will regret it. Because she cannot do this to my sister and go scot free. She will have me to contend with. Don't worry, Papa. No, 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 no. I, I need to do this. Because if I don't do it, uh, it will swell. Look at this, me. Angel, you are the one holding me back. Otherwise, otherwise, if you just take me a phone call, I'll get that get up. Anyway, I'll see the father. I'll see the father tomorrow morning. Okay. Sorry, sorry. Yes, I'll show you that this will not happen again. I'll put a stop to it. You will not believe the history assignment our history teacher gave us today in class. Tell me about it. I might be of help. Oh, this one is above you. He said I should go and write the history of my village. Oh. <laughs> Why that's, are you laughing? that's huge. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You mean your teacher, our teacher, asked you to write the history of your village? Okay. Angel, over to you. Uh -uh. Simeo, how am I supposed to know the history of our village? I don't know. Uh -uh. Aren't you your father's first child? Uh -huh. No. Uh -huh. Must every first child know the history of their village? Yes, that's why you're the first child. How old am I? No, <laughs> I don't know. Angel, you should know. I have no age mates. She's saying I should know. I don't know. Must I know everything? Yeah. Oh. You, know, you know what? It's not a problem. See what I'll do. When I get to the house, I'll check Papa's drawer and check all the documents in the drawer. I will definitely see something that is related to the history of our village. I'll get something to write about our village, don't worry. But why would your teacher tell you to write? I said, don't even mm, understand. As if she my... can tell the history of our own village. Mm. That, you, you that does not even know. Hey, 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 Adam Awa. I know I finished now. Come on, me. I'm quite a bomb. Medu Guru. You are not at the table. You will write the history. I'm not on point. No, 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 no. Don't disgrace me like this now. Ah, please. Let's I say I'm quite a bomb. Medu Guru. Hey! Let this be between us. Let, 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 let's not go away from it. Don't worry. Let's go. Let's go home. Let's go. Erika, it's in Pataka.
lovely sisters. They love themselves. They were lovely sisters. Oh, lovely sisters. Fafula wefananya. They care for each other. Their love is super. Every can one in the mouth. I love you so much. And you know one in the mouth. I love you so much. Every can one in the mouth. I love you so much. And you know one in the mouth. I love you so much. Every can one in the mouth. I love you so much. And you know one in the mouth. I love you so much. She does not belong there. Listen, Erica. If you don't do anything about that, all the love, the care, the attention that your father is supposed to give to you will be given to her. Hmm. Aru. Chisom, I think you're right. Do you know since we were small, whenever my father buys anything for us, he tells her to choose first as the other. Huh? I'm telling you. As if I'm a prophetess. You see? Did you tell me this earlier? No, but I've seen the angle things are going and I know this will happen. It has started happening already and you don't want to do anything about it. <laughs> nah. If you do nothing about this, hmm? even your marriage rights will be given to her by your father. Eh? Yes. When she wants to get married tomorrow, your father will buy her plenty gifts and you will be left with nothing. Hmm. In fact, I am 110% sure that she is your father's nest of kin in his pension rights. His gratuity, his death benefit, eh? and his retirement benefit. 
anything at all that has to do with your father belongs to her. Manuna. Listen, if your father dies tomorrow, the woman we call her, she will be the one to tie George and carry your father's picture and be dancing. People will be spraying her. She will be getting kids. She will be getting all the love as your father's first daughter. Why you will be left with nothing? You will be behind as a slave. Eh? Yes. And do more that. Early in the morning, they will call her out. Abu Kilikili. She will be in their midst to dance. They will spray her money. A well tea in her bread. She will be treated as the first child. Meanwhile, it is your right. Act, Erika. Do something else. Obawana rain. Jesus. Jesus. Eh? Hey. Over my dead body will I allow this to happen? It will never happen, not when I'm alive. This useless angel left her father and came to my father's house to dominate. She came to dominate me and my father. Forming a dad of the house when I'm supposed to be the one to be bragging as a Daneru Kuano. As the only child. You are supposed to be bragging as the only child. Your father is supposed to be pampering you. He's supposed to carry you as an egg. But no, he's showing all that love to Angel. Do you know since we're small? If they give us meat, Angel will take the bigger share of the meat. They will give me tiny one because she's Ada. Hey! When I'm actually the Ada, the real Ada of the house. Hey! Do you know that she's just like a thief? She has come to steal your birthright. If at all this while she knew she's not the biological daughter of my father, she has been pretending. I think so. Very poisonous human. It's possible. That's why every smarty she will tell me she's she's other, she's older than me. Oh. If no. I don't act, call me bastard. I trust you. Hmm? Once you get home, start with the action. I'm acting already. Give her war. Make her regret her life. Make her regret her existence. Jason, thank you for this information. You're welcome. I'm going there now. If I get to the house, I will frustrate Angel until she will pack her things and leave that house. You need to. I will deal with I will finish her. You need to. You need to. Hey! Angel! Hey, remember, if you don't act, some more that will make tea for her. How can I well I am acting already. Thank you for this information. I'm acting already. I'm sure that land that is by the west uh, 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 palace, mm. your father has given it to her. I am 100% sure. I'm very sure. Hey! 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 Make sure you act very... Angel! 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 I'm talking to you! Angel! Angel, come here! See, you're not going anywhere if you don't go in there and arrange my room. Go and arrange the room, my friend! What is wrong with you? Sorry, did you say arrange your room? I don't understand it. Since when did we start having separate rooms in this house? Since when I realized you don't belong in this house and you don't have a space in this place. What? What did you just say? That I do not have a place in this house? What's the meaning of that? Erika, what has come over you? This is not you that I know. What is it? Why are you asking a dumb question? Go in there and arrange your room, my friend. In Apuala. <laughs> Erika, if you touch me, if you, I've been, I've been keeping myself, I've been trying to cool my temper, but you do not want to allow me. Mm. Erika, if you touch me one more time, I will hit you so hard. You will hit me. I will hit you so hard. Try it. I will smash your head on this wall. You don't know me, oh. You don't know what you are dealing with. If you try to touch me again, mm. I swear I will give you the beating of your life. I will kill you with my bare hands. I will so? squeeze life out of you. you. Think you can yes. Touch me. I said, come back here. I'll break. I'll break. If you touch me, if you, if you, if you don't, if you, if you touch me one more, what will I do? If you, if you, if you touch me one more, I will break your head. You try. Too much. I will touch me. Touch me again. See, touch me again now. Just touch me again. Very careful. Touch me now. I'm leaving you. You leave me who? Touch me. I'm leaving you. Touch me. Touch me. Don't touch me. Let me give you the gun. Are you mad? Papa, 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 
front and the back door. Why? Please, can I have the keys? I want to go inside. No, I'm not giving you the key. I have told you countlessly that you don't have a space in this house. You don't belong here. The, only, re the only reason I will give you this key is if you will go inside, pack your things and get out from this house. Because you don't belong here. You don't have a space here. Meaning what? What has come over you? Chukwerik, I ask, what has gotten into you? What has taken over you? What is all this? I have called you countless times and I've asked you if there's anything I've done wrong, any way I've offended you without even knowing, tell me and I will humbly apologize. But you have refused to say anything. Why are you being mean towards me? How, how sudden have you forgotten how we've been doing in this house? Where did I ever go wrong? Of what use will it be to you if I pack my things and leave my own father's house and leaving you all by yourself to stay here? What? I don't understand. Let me tell you. I am not ready for all of this. And if they sent you to me, go back and tell them that you did not see me. Just quietly hand over those keys to me. Let me go inside the house. Wait, you said father. Which father? You are a bastard. That's are you mad? What? Are you ah! stupid? Are you mad? Are you mad? How dare you? Me? Are you stupid? No, are you stupid? No, 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 wait. What's wrong with you? No, wait, wait. What's wrong with you? Let me start. Let me start. Let me start. If you insult me one more time, I will beat you mercilessly. You will collect more beating. No man in the father is here. You will beat me. More. Try it first. Father. You want to? Look at this one. You want to kill your sister? What's up? Yes. This girl is being very, very, very stupid. She has been talking to me anyhow. She has been insulting me, calling me all sorts of names. What did I ever do to her? Am I lying? Is my father your biological father? What? Mother, answer me! Erika, shut up! Shut up there! What nonsense are you blabbering about? Who is not her father? What are you saying? Have, have you gone nuts? I, 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 are you drunk? How can you be talking to your sister like that? Which sister? Eh? Papa, she is not related to me in any way! We are not the same blood group. We don't act the same. She can never be my sister, Papa. Erika, shut up! Shut the hell up! What are you saying? Are you, are, are you all right? Your, your own sister, you, you, you say things like this? Papa, tell her the truth now. What truth? You, you are an honorable man, a respected police officer. Look her in the face and tell her that she is not your daughter. She is not my sister, Papa. Why are you pretending? Tell her the truth. Agini. What? Papa. What has happened to your sister? <laughs> Papa. A A Angel. What is going on here? I, I, I don't... What did Erica just say? That's what I'm asking. Are you not my father? How can you say that? Am I not your biological daughter? Angel. Even you, how can you say something? I, I, I Papa, am saying that she is drunk. Look me straight in the eyes and tell me that you are my father. Yes! Your sister is drunk! Something is going on here. What happened to you? Did they use you for, for money ritual or something? Me? Drunk? How can you say my own daughter is no longer my daughter? Are you alright? <laughs> me, man. Breeze don't blow. Fire ash don't open. <laughs> Don't listen to her. She's talking nonsense. She's drunk. She's on drugs. 
I'm, I'm sure this guy has started taking Mpuru Mini. You are my daughter. Angel. My first daughter. How, how can anybody be saying this about you? I, 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 and your belief? How can you believe such a thing? You, you're breaking my heart. You, you're breaking my heart. Angel, you're my daughter. I don't know. I don't know. Please, please don't just come over my sister. I don't know. Please, don't listen to her. You're my daughter. It's okay. It's okay. Nothing will happen to you. You're my daughter. Anytime, anything. You're my first daughter. You're the heir to my to whatever I own. You. Yes. Thank you. What has come over you? Eh? You used to love your sister so much. Why the sudden change? Answer me. Papa, she doesn't belong here. She is not your biological daughter. Let's tell ourselves the truth. That is why I want her to leave. What truth are you talking about? Who told you Angel is not your sister? Who told you that? You think I don't know? I know everything, no. I even have concrete evidence. What nonsense evidence are you talking about? Listen to me. Take your mind off this direction you're going to. You're hurting me for no reason. Angel is your elder sister. And she's my first daughter. Whether I like it or not. That is the sister. I should tell you who is my daughter and who is not. Not you telling me. Elder sister, my foot. Listen, the earlier you tell her to start packing her things, the better for her. Papa, tell her to pack her things and leave this house. Else, what I will do to her, she will not like it. A stranger will just come from nowhere and start forming elder sister over me. Occupying my space for no reason. Shut up, Erika. Tell her to pack her things, else she will not like what I will do. Tell her, oh. Tell that stranger to leave this house. Hey, oh. Erika, come back here. You walked out on me again. Chukwu Erika! Demon has entered you, Erika. You have sold your soul to devil. You hate your sister with passion. Give me come, Meregio. Chukwu Erika. Marakwa nuku na ke wara wara nenuwa. Anya na ke zam zam na fushi kwa ike. What do you stand to gain in all this wickedness? Remember, judgment day is coming on. Papa, Papa, Rocky, Chukwe, Rika. My hair went so to the devil, you see. Oh, in there, no problem. Papa, Rocky, Erika. My hair went so to the devil, you see. Oh, in there, no problem. Papa, Rocky, Chukwe, Rika. My hair went so to the devil, you see. Oh, in there, no problem. Erika, Mama. My hair went so to the devil, you see. What's that for? What's what? Why don't you have to bring my clothes together? I have not told you not to spread clothes on this rope again. Why? Have I not warned you? Your madness has started again. Your madness has started again. Don't you touch my clothes. Angel, you are daring me, oh. Go and look for your father's... Okay. Go and look for your father's room and put your clothes. What nonsense? Ah. Go and look for your father's room. Don't touch my clothes again. Go and look for your father's room. Don't touch my clothes again. again. Don't touch my clothes again. again. My father bought this one for me. Papa! My clothes. Papa! Is it your father? I don't want to have you. He's not your father. He's my father. Ah, let me see you touch. Why is it so difficult for you? Leave this house. You don't want to leave. Let me see you touch it. Why you would go and look for your father and stay in his house? Leave my father alone. You're a stranger. It's not my fault. It's not my fault. I don't know why you're always taking sides with me. Hey, let this be the very last time you're going to fight your sister in this house. Do you hear me? Papa, let her pack her things and leave this house. I don't know why you always calling her my sister. She's not my sister. She's a bastard. What? 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 Are you what? You call my own daughter, my first daughter, a bastard? In my house, in my presence? Are you what? What has gone into your head? Erika! 
Because did you just call me a bastard? Are you not a bastard? What? Are you not? No, she's talking. My father just slapped me up because of this idiot. Listen, pack your things and leave this house and stop occupying my space. If you don't, I will make this house a living hell for you. What? Erika, come back here. What kind of devil has entered my, 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 my Erica? What is going on? This whole. So this is the reason both of you have not been talking to each other in school anymore. Even when I try to talk to her, she ignores me. I don't know what suddenly came over my sister. She started saying all sorts of things to me. I should stop talking to her. That I don't belong to, to my father. That I'm an illegitimate child. Uh -uh. It's nothing she didn't tell me. Every day. I just, I just, I just, I'm just tired. And to think I love her so much. It has really broken me. What has gotten over Erica? What is going on? I don't know. And what is your father saying about it? He has tried so many times to caution her, but she wouldn't listen. So he only said I should, I should just ignore her, that she will come around. But you know, she still hasn't come around. I don't know. Erika that I seniored with four days, four solid days. Each time I come to her, she talks to me like she's my senior. Let's not even talk about senior. We, we have strong bond. We have strong bond, but I don't know what, I don't know. I have no idea. But you see that devil, that devil will be shamed. Amen. will be put to shame. Amen. But I think you should listen to your father. Right? Yes. You know he's an elder and he knows more than you do. So just listen to him and tolerate Erica. Please. But just, I need your candid advice. Okay. Be honest with me, please. Okay. Do you think I should just leave the house? At least leave the house for half, at least for the meantime. Let peace reign. Leave which house? Our house. What are you saying? What you should do is give her silent treatment. She's nothing but a fool. Silence is the best answer given to a fool. She is a fool. Keep her total silence. Erica! What is it? Erica, wait now. What, oh, Ogini? Look, you cannot be talking to my enemy and be talking to me. Choose one. Choose a friend. You see what I've been saying? Erica, you're not my enemy. You're my blood sister. You are my enemy! Yeah? Take a stand. Erica. You see what I've been saying? Oh, if he married you, you may want to say, Oh, he never wanted to say, Oh, he never wanted to say, Oh, he never Demon has entered you, Erica. You have sold your soul to the devil. You hate your sister with passion. Give me come, Erica. Shuku Erica. Marabwa nuku na ke wara wara nenuwa. Anya na ke zam zam na fushi kwa ike. What do you stand to gain in all this wickedness? This is the poor son. It is our boy. Who must have happened? What happened to the chunk of food I left in this spot? We prepared enough food for, for crying out loud. Who could have done this? Who could have? 
this no be the papa had visitors and he had to finish this whole food and knowing full well that when we come back we'll be hungry. Why will papa do this kind of thing to us now? No. My father can never do a thing like this. Nigga, don't waste it in me. Asa, asa, kumita, asa. Eh? Hmm. Let it not be what I'm thinking. Let it not be that Erika is responsible for the disappearance of this food. And I'm so full. I'm so hungry. I'm so hungry. Erika. Erika. School. The food is finished. So be it. I don't understand. What do you mean, so be it? I don't want to talk too much. I made that food myself. And I knew how full that pot was before I left for school. So can you begin to talk right now? Are you deaf? I said I ate the food. Shut up! How can you tell me that you ate the food? Okay. How can you finish that pot of food alone? It's all right. I will ask you for the very last time, Erica. Where is the remaining I food? Ate the food? What are you going to do about it? What, what is going on here? What again? <laughs> what again? Is, what is this commotion about? Papa. Okay, Papa. Yes. You saw the food I made before leaving for school this yes, morning. Yes, you saw yes, how big it was. Yes. The pot was still very full, which was supposed to go around again sure. in the afternoon. Sure. Now, on getting back, I went to the pot. Not just that there is no food. Not even a grain of rice is remaining in that pot. And I asked her, she said she ate the food. But I, I know Erika cannot finish that chunk of food alone. That's not possible. That is not possible. Erika, what are you talking about? How could you say you finished that whole pot of food without your sister? What happened? Papa, I dished the food, took it to school and gave it to my friends. We all ate the food together. What? Erika, you did what? No, I, wa I want to understand you. You did what, Erika? You took the food I made for the family, for everyone here, to your friends, in school. And you ate without remembering your sister. Your own sister, Erica, you didn't care about me when I come back from school. Who cares? Why would you do this to me? Why? If you want to die, die now, what's my business? Shut up, Erica. Shut up. How could you say you, you took food from my house? To strangers out there and forget about your own sister. How could you say that? What kind of what kind of nonsense is that? Papa, stop calling her my sister. Oh, I've told you before, she's not my sister. She can never be my sister. She should go out there and look for her father. You are not her biological father. Ah! Uh -uh. Besides, those girls you are calling strangers are not strangers. They are my bosom friends. They will, deserve the food more than her. Will you keep quiet, Erika? Will you keep quiet? Listen, you have crossed the boundary on this matter. Oh, yes, you have. And you get me angry, you know what I can do. What kind of nonsense is this? What has got into your head? I have warned you to stop this nonsense about your sister not being your sister. Stop it, stop it, and stop it. If you don't stop it... Andrea, Andrea, come back here. Come. See, man. Ebe lama Wame, wame, ebe la ma huwai, wame, wame, ebe la ma huwai, wame, wame, ebe la ma huwai. Wame, wame, ebe la ma kuwai, wame, wame, ebe la ma kuwai, wame, wame, Angel. 
Why do you have to isolate yourself here? Why? Listen, dear. Don't listen to your sister. Don't listen to Erika. She's jealous of you. You are my daughter. My first daughter. How can you be listening to the nonsense she's saying? It's affecting me too. Well, Erika was never like this. So why would she be jealous of me? Papa, please. I, I want to ask you a question. And I need nothing but the truth from you. Go ahead. Am I a bastard? No. Are you truly my biological father? Yes, yes. Did I truly come out from your loins? Tell me the truth, father, please. Yes, yes, you did. Erica is lying. She's telling lies. She's fabricating all this nonsense to hurt you and even hurt me too. You're my daughter. You're my first daughter. You came out from my loins. How could you be doubting me? I, I, I feel so hurt that even you, you are doubting me. I'm not doubting you, but I'm not happy with all I know, of this. I, I know, my know. dear, I know. I, I know. don't know what I'm thinking I over my sister. Feel, I don't know. No, no. I, I don't know, too. I don't know the devil that has gone into her head. I don't know. Please, please help me endure this. It, it cannot continue like this. I will do something about this. I will do something very radical about this. And it will end. Trust me. Trust me, Angel. Please. But for now, just eat. Eat something. You came back from school since you have not eaten. I had to go and buy this food for you. Since that, 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 that devilish girl, I don't know what, what, what affected her brain. Hey, this food did not give me a small spoon. What is wrong with all these people now? Look, look I bought rice. Uh -huh. It's good. Very nice. Please, keep it. Let, let me go and bring a spoon for you. Oh, oh, come into the house and eat now. No, come into the house and eat. question, please? Another question? Let me beg you for a favor. Okay, go ahead. The only food I want now is peace from my sister. Please beg her for me to forgive me. If I've done anything to Erica, let her forgive me and give me peace in my father's I house. Please, I, 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 I want to send her away from here. No. no, I want to send her out of this house. Please don't send her away. Just... Let her just forgive me. I'm sorry. I can I can beg her. Okay, yeah. okay, okay. I, okay. I don't mind even though to beg her. It's okay. I'll talk to her. I'll, I'll do something radical about this. Trust me. I'm a retired police officer. You, you seem to forget. I'll do something very drastic about this. I to end. You know, I don't want you to be going through this torture. This trauma is too much. It's affecting me too. I can't even sleep in the night. Eh? Sorry, dear. So keep it. Let, let me bring a spoon for you. Oh, come into the house and eat. Please. Please, please. I'm begging you. Oh, please. I will, I will bring an end to this nonsense. Trust me. Please, please, stop isolating yourself. Stop being so sad. Your sister is talking nonsense. You are mad. You are stupid. So let me tell you, everything belongs to me in this house. From the top you are wearing to your sandals belongs to me. You are the one no mad. You are the one that is crazy. I've been keeping quiet in this house. You don't want peace. Papa has been giving us money. If he gives us money, you, you use your own and buy a car. Buy anything you want to buy. It's not my problem. I've always told you to have savings. But you blatantly refused. I would force you. It's your decision. So now, you had the nerve to go into my box to take my money. As what? Can I have that money now? Which money? You see this money? I'm not giving it to you. This money will never reach your hand. The money belongs to me. Ibonyala. Let me have that I'm money! I'm not giving you this... Ah, uh, Angel! Uh, Angel! Take this money! Angel, if you break my hand! Angel! Oh, Angel! Leave my Angel! What again? What again? Who do my guy? What is this again? What? Angel! Leave her alone! You want to kill her?
She's not my sister. Why do you say that? I have a concrete evidence. Where is it? Let us see it. Go and bring it. Where is it? Go! Let her go and bring it down. Huh? Yeah. Ah. He man has entered you, Erika. You have sold your soul to devil. You hate your sister with passion. Give me come, Erika. Chukwu Erika. What you stand to gain in all this wickedness? Remember, judgment day is coming up. Papa, Baroki, Chukwerika. Come, don't waste the time of the gods. Hurry up. Decided to adopt a child and bring her into this house. Mm -hmm. Are you in a position to decide who should stay and who should not stay? No, the answer is no. You are not in the position. Not at all. You have that right. What you have committed, this evil that you have done, has never been committed in this land before. Therefore, we shall not let you dwell among us. Dwell in no way. We cannot continue. Erica, let me tell you, for committing this evil in our land, you are hereby banished immediately. Bam. And it takes effect from now. Now, stop. Go. Move up. Up. I know the crime my sister committed is a very grievous one. In fact, there's nothing to talk about. It's an abomination. But please, I beg you, temper justice with mercy. My father is already gone. When she leaves, I'll be the only one left in this house. Please, I've already passed away a lot. I cannot, I cannot be, I cannot be alone, and I don't want her. She doesn't even have anywhere to go. If you send her out, she'll just be wandering about the streets without me. Something terrible might happen to her. I don't want to lose my own, my only sibling. Please, do not chase her away. Please, please forgive her. Please, please, please. My sister, Angel is right. Ah, eh? Your sister? Oh, she is now your sister, eh? Mm. Ah! Mm -hmm. Hey, God. Hey, Chia. Serario. Angel. Your sister here mm. committed an evil act. And whosoever that killed somebody in this community must to be banished. And she has to leave. Immediately. Yes! We will ask the youth to throw her out. One time. It was an accident. It wasn't intentional. Mm -hmm. It was and an accident. Uh, she has to leave. <laughs> it was an accident. <laughs> please don't just say it away. I beg you, please. Don't. You know what? We're not going to fight again. And we're not going to fight again. Right? We're not going to fight again. Please. <laughs> I'm forgiving her everything she has done to me. Don't chase her away. She might get hurt, please. You know what you're doing? Get up. Ale. You want to go? Move, 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 move. I'm trying to get Go, 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 go. 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 Go, go,
Ah, uh, madam, what's in the what's in the keep you now? Bring the beer. Come on, come on, come. Where the pursuit? What's in the keep you sis? May I take this over your body? Make I arrange the pursuit for you. Go ahead, go fast. For four months, no. Because I come here. No girl glass. Okay, I'm not gonna let them speak to me now. Where the pursuit now? Where the pursuit for me?
tóc quá Since I finished my work, it's just been moving up and down. I don't have a job. I'm, I'm just too lonely in this village. And it makes me to think. I keep thinking all the time. So, I decided to go to the city for greener pasture. No matter how small I begin, I believe I'll make it. And I'm being in this village all by myself. I've, I've practically lost everything. My father, my beloved sister is no longer here. So I'm not doing anything. So I decided to tell you because very soon you'll stop seeing me around here. Um, Angel, I understand you. And your idea is not bad at all. I've also thought of that. Because since we finished our secondary education, I've been here doing nothing. I also want to go to the city to look for something to do. You know I don't have anyone that will help see me through higher institution. So I want to go and know if I can make some money and start up again. You are saying the same thing. And I can't wait to get to the city. Once I get there, I'll, I'll look for my sister Erika. I really miss her so much. That's impossible. How do you mean? She can't find her. Why? City is not like the village. It is very big. Do you know that you can stay there for 10 years without coming in contact with her? Zilla. I'm telling you the truth. My cousin that stays in the city already told me that. So I know. I miss, I miss Erica. I miss my father too. I miss them. It's okay. It's okay. Stop crying. <laughs> Everything will be well. Hmm? Did I think about them? It's as if the world has ended. God will help us. At least you have your family around. I have no one to call my own. It's okay. You have me. <laughs> Thank you so much, Izo. It's okay. Thank you for being a good friend. I saw a vacancy, vacancy signboard there, so I believe you could need a sales girl. Yes, we need person to work for you, but no man, no. It doesn't really matter. I can do what a man can do. Where is your other piece? I need to see him. No, I'm not there. You know what they do with floats today, so I go somewhere. Oh, okay. Well, it doesn't really matter. Okay, when can I see him? I mean, when is he going to be back? Not tomorrow, he will come back. Oh. Then I'll have to come back tomorrow. I need to see him one-on-one. -on -one. Yeah. Yes. 
I am interested in the job. But this ties though. Hope you can do the work. I'm a very strong woman. I can do anything. As long as the pay is good. You can I know Allah. Where you mm. come tomorrow, Sha? Okay, I will come. Please a cheaping word for me. Tell him that someone actually came and the person looks strong. Okay, I will tell him. Okay. I will uh, tell him. Um what, what's your name? My name is Nagozi. Okay. Um Angel. Okay. Oh? Gozi, okay. please remember, cheaping word for me. I go, I will tell him. Don't Thank worry. You. Yeah. Come tomorrow. Hello, hi. How are you? I'm fine. Um, my name is Josh. Um, can I drop you off, please? Oh, come on, just allow me to drop you off, all right? I wouldn't hurt you, I promise. I don't, I don't know who you are. Please, come on, okay? Just oblige me, please. Let me drop you off. So, is this where you live? Uh, yes, it's where I'm managing for now. Do you want to come inside? Okay. Wait, is this the reason why you didn't want me to come and drop you off all this while? I mean, sweetheart, you cannot possibly be living here, not when you have me in your life. I don't have a problem with this place I'm leaving. I'm okay, don't worry yourself. No, I have to worry. Sweetheart, look. Um, I think this is what we are going to do. You would have to move in with me so that we can. I love you very much, okay? And I really want to get married to you. Let's start living as a couple. Oh no, please! I, I'm not ready for marriage now. All I want is to work very hard, make money, and look for my sister, so we can reconcile. That's all I want now. I need to reconcile with her. Angel, listen to me. You know, if it's about money, you don't have to worry about it. I can take care of you perfectly. Sweetheart, I will establish a business for you. All right, please, I beg you, just move in with me. I would not hurt you. Never. I would never, ever hurt you in this life. I just want to, I, I want to take care of you. And guess what? I'll help you find your sister. We can both look for your sister together. You will? I promise I will. Okay, if you say so, then I, I'll think about it and I'll get back to you.
you think you're going to? Listen, my boss said you are no longer allowed here. You're going to stay here and I will inform him that you're here. I don't understand. What, what is going on? What do you mean by that? Hey, didn't you hear her? Our boss said you are no longer needed here. I've not done anything wrong. I mean, I, think, I believe if there's a problem, he should discuss it with me and not like this. Please, I need to see Josh now. Stay here! Let me go and inform him that you're back. If he wants to see you, he will come out. Josh, Josh has never treated me like this. Please, please talk to me. Did he tell you anything that I did? No. Please. Come if temptation is this one now. If there was a problem now, he could have, could have discussed it with me. He's not even taking my call. Josh! Josh! Josh, please come outside! Why? What have I done wrong? And even if I did something, you couldn't have allowed your workers to treat me like this. You should call me and we'll discuss it. If I'm wrong, I will apologize. Why are you doing this now? What have I done wrong? I've been waiting to tell you this. I'm afraid if I don't tell you now, it might be too late for me. Please tell me what have I done, please. If I wronged you, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, please. I'm sorry. Please talk to me about it, please. I, I, I don't know you to be like this. Light up my world. Angel. You made me discover the true essence of a man. I'm afraid I might lose you if I don't do this. Great is Zanza of Udume land. I greet you. Welcome to the shrine of Great Zanga. <laughs> mm. Draw the gift of Great Zanza. Now, what do you want the Great Zanza to do for you? Great Zanza, I am here because of my sister. She's living a life of luxury while I'm in the ghetto, suffering, selling hot drinks and cigarettes. She doesn't care about me. So what do you want me to do to her? 
Great is answer. I want her dead. Eliminate her. She is the reason for my predicament today. You want her dead? Yes. Great is answer. We heard her. Grant her her wish. Oh, wake on the road. I will wake on the road. I want to run by Funanya. I want to run by Funanya. Hmm. I think with the Labradano. The great is answer. Eman with the Labano. I can never work on here. You did it. I thought you were. Oh, you're like a hair. You're with the Labradano. You're with the Labradano. You're with the Labradano. Oh, wake on the road. I will wake on the road. I want to run Bapunana. I want to run Bapunana. The great is answer. You better. I think you're going to hear you. I'll be looking at you in the laboratory. I'm not going to hear you. I'm going to talk to 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 you. Eku kumeku 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 Eku kumeku Eku kumeku kumeku Eku kumeku Eku kumeku Eku kumeku Send her message And I don't own that. You don't patronize me. Don't do this. We both agree that we will spend a day together. Why the sudden change? I, it's not intentional. I mean, it, this is a circumstance beyond my control. I work for someone, you know that. I don't want to have issues with my boss. Please, let me go do my job. What? I was supposed to be at work too. But look at me, I'm here. Honey. What am I supposed to be walking without you? I know. But trust me, I would not waste time. Baby boy, come on. I will not waste time. Like when you do this one. Yeah, I know you like it. Okay, how long are you going to? Just two hours. I won't be long. Just two hours? You said just two hours, like it's just. Come on, two hours is a lot of time. It is not. If I get to the office, it's already 30 minutes. And then do one or two. Come on, don't be like this. 
Okay, one hour. I said, just one hour. One hour, 30 minutes. <laughs> okay, honey, I gotta go. Hey, hey, go like that. Come on. Come on. Gotta go. Give me some sugar. I gotta go. Give me some sugar, baby. Give me some sugar. Oh, love. No good. Kill you. <laughs> Bye. All right, darling. I'm gonna miss you. Yeah. Oh, my God. When did you get in? And where have you been? I've been calling you for hours. You said you were going to be away for just two hours, but this is over five hours. Where have you been? I'm sorry. You're sorry? Sorry does not change anything here. You think you're just going to come here and say you're sorry? And, and that takes away everything? You think it will just make it right? I can explain. Of course you need to explain. Start talking. Where have you been since the last five hours? Let me hear it. He promised to give me time. Are you serious? What has time got to do with what we're saying right now? Where have you been since the last five hours? That's what I asked you. He promised. That it's just going to be me and me alone. Right? <sighs> reverse psychology. That's what you're doing, reverse psychology. You're trying to use reverse psychology. Well, it's not going to work. Whatever antics that you came with here, it's not going to work until you tell me where you have been since the last five hours. I want you to promise me that no one is ever going to take my place in your heart. Promise? So what is wrong with you? You said I'm the best. You said I'm your better half. You said I'm everything to you. Same promise you made to me. I want you to reassure me. Promise? Am I getting the assurance? Of course I'm going to reassure you, but I just want you to understand that this does not change anything. Alright, you are going to tell me where you have been since the last five hours. So yes, can we start talking? I'm not ready for whatever you're doing right now. Come down here and tell me where you've been. Why are you calling me? If you have anything to say, come down here and say it. Look, Angel, listen to me. What did you say? I said, my name is Sandra from Victoria Hospital. Am I speaking to Mr. Okechu? Yes, you are. All right, sir. Please, your number happens to be the last number that called the phone, and the owner of this phone was involved in the gas and the motor accident. Please, can you come to our hospital for confirmation? Hello? Hello? Hello, Mr. Okechu, are you there? 
Look, listen to me. Whatever trick or prank you're trying to play here, I'm not finding it funny anymore. What is going on? Sir, I don't understand. How would I in the war want to jump on my job? I'm Dr. Sandra from Victoria Hospital. I'm calling to inform you that you're not supposed to be the last caller to this before number. And so you should come to our hospital at GRA for confirmation. Repeat what you said. I just said that the person that wants this phone number just got involved in the casting motor aspect. They should go to our hospital to confirm that body. Victoria Hospital at GRA. Said my girlfriend was involved in an accident. What's her name? Angel. Angel is her name. Angel. Okay, yeah. How are you related to her? She, she's my fiance. Your fiance? Yes. Come with me. Okay. Let's go. Please, let's go. It's all you can't leave me, please. Please, you promise me that you will be alive. Please, I beg you, don't. Don't leave me. Please, we have a lot to do together. Our dreams.
Mama? Mama, if we don't leave now, you'll miss the bus. Ha. Mama! Mama! Please hurry up. We have to leave now. You'll miss the bus. Please, sir. I must not inform you that I'm coming to see you. No, no, you have to. I must have not to. inform you. Mama. Good evening, Ma. Uh, Mama. Uh, Mama. Thank God you haven't even left um, this, um, this angel. angel. Yeah, um, of course, she didn't tell me she was coming, but this is a surprise and it's a pleasant one. So, Mama, meet the love of my life, Angel. Angel, meet my lovely and adorable mother. Wow, it's been she... nice to meet you, Ma. Ah. Oh, thank you, Ma. I'm loving her already. I see. Mm. I really love it. Sit down. Thank you, Ma. So, how are you? I'm very fine. Where are you from? How old are you? Who are your parents? Hey, Mama, cool down. Oh, Mama, your boss. You have to leave now. I've forgotten. Hey, Mama, I'm going to answer all of your questions. But before then, I would like you to test my food. That's good. So I'll quickly go into the kitchen and make something nice for you. That's good. Place. Thank you. Intelligent girl. It's like you're about to travel. No, I'm not traveling again. Okay. I've um, changed my mind. I've uh, you have to wait. She has to test my food. <laughs> I'm not going again. The boss. It has to. I'll be fast. You know how I do. No. Okay, no. Okay, so we'll take the bag upstairs. I'm not, I'm not traveling fast. again. I'll be fine. God bless you, Nene. Oh. I'm not traveling again. Mama, you're not what? Mm -hmm. You're having a small child at home. I'm not going anywhere. Keep my bag. She's beautiful. Sit down. Sit down. I like her. Mama, you have to go now. I am not going again. Many I'm what? staying. I want to test my daughter-in-law's food. I like her. She's beautiful. I really like her. And I like her backside. She there. Yes. You like beauty. See, on that back, I see three plates sitting. Yes, three. Yes, two boys and a girl. Mama, I only want to have two children. Mm? This one you're talking about, three. Mm, what is for me? <laughs> mm. Mama, Mama. Yeah. Mm. You like her? Yes. No see problem. See you. So you won't go again? Mm. See you. Can pretend? So let me take your bag upstairs. No problem. That's for good things. Uh, why would I have eyes for good? Have you seen yourself? Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Have you seen yourself? Like father, like son. I don't know. Yeah. I'll do like my father. <laughs> so happy. She naked. So finally, Kiruka. So that was what happened. I was just trying to talk to her and she wasn't even listening to me. And I decided to stay on my own. You know, in life, you don't force people to like you. Babe. Babe, you've been. You've been mute all along. You've not been talking to me. What seems to be the problem? Come on, honey. Honey, talk to me. You have always said that I am your better half. If you really mean it, then share your problems with me. Remember, a problem shared is a problem half solved. Please tell me, what is bothering you? I'm sorry. Why? Even when I'm here? It just feels like you do not want us to take this relationship to the next level. Babe! Why would you even say such a thing? I mean, I don't even know your parents. I don't know where you stay. I don't know any of your siblings. I know nothing about you. It just feels like... You don't really want us to take this to the next level? No, don't say that. Listen, honey, I love you as much as you love me. And I really want us to be couple if God permits, okay? But I just need time. I need time for everything to fall in place. How much time do you want? How long do you want us to do this? Is there someone else? No! Baby, don't even say that. I don't want to ever lose you. Please. Baby, you will not lose me. It will never happen. Honey, there is nobody else. 
If there was someone else, I wouldn't be here with you. I love you. Prove it. Show me you love me. How? Let me meet your parents. Let us breach this, this distance between us. It just feels like you are. Like we're not really connected. Let me pay you bright price today. Now. Beautiful to love birds. Huh. God bless this children for me and grant your heart desires. Amen. Honey. Uh -huh. Angel, what's the problem? Why is my son's face like that? Uh, my, I, I offended him indirectly. So, but I, I just hope he can really understand me. What exactly did you do to my son? Not like I did something so wrong. I told him something and he got offended. I don't know how to explain this honestly, but I wish he can just give me time for me to explain. I, I, I've got a lot of answers to give to him, but I just need time. Okay, I need to talk to myself. Mom, please help me talk to him. He's so mad at me now. Angel! Angel, please wake up! Angel! I have come to appreciate you with these gifts for everything you have done for me. I am grateful. You are always welcome. Thank you very much. Hand it over to Ogman.
were late. You missed me? How's your night? Well, my night was very short. Why? Because I was cheating and laughing with the love of my life. <laughs> I'm glad you like it. <laughs> Have you eaten something? Not yet. Mm, I wish I could cook for you. You know you don't have to do that, all right? Watching you alone makes me very happy. I say that because I know how much you love my food. I know. Someone's coming. He won't see me. Just you alone. Coming! Oh, Caleb. Good morning. Good morning, how are you? I'm okay. Oh. I thought I heard you speaking with someone. That must be your imagination. Bad guy. <laughs> it's like you're keeping a woman in this office. Look, there's no woman here, but if you want to check, you're free to do it. You can't be smarter than me. All I know is I'm going to catch that woman you always talk to in this office. Oh, guy, leave this rubbish you're talking about. Let us uh, get to work, okay? Um, anyways. Well, I came to let you know that we're all set for the meeting. The directors are waiting. So I came to let you know so you can put us through. Oh, yeah, that's true. Um, all right, just um, go ahead. I'll, I'll join you guys soon. My CEO! Oh, uh, brother. We'll be waiting. All right, no problem. I'll join you soon, okay? All right. <laughs> I got you as many clothes as I could. I just hope you like them. Like? Like is an understatement, babes. I 
love them. You know I love anything you do for me. But unfortunately, you know I can't wear them. But the mere sight of them gladdens my heart. Especially you buying them for me today, which happens to be my birthday. It's my birthday today. Not alive. Yes, I know. But it's still my birthday. It's still special to me. Very special. I wish I could wish I could turn back the hands of time. This beautiful moment with you. Looking at you like this always is enough for me. Well 
behaved girls all over the place. Why is it difficult for you to pick one? Well, if picking a wife is a problem to you, well, I volunteer. I volunteer as your mother to pick one for you. Mama, you will not pick a wife for me. I will pick a wife or find a wife for myself when I am ready. Okay? Besides, I am still grieving. Grieving over who? Grieving over my fiance. Da! Da! Don't even say the one that people will think you're mad. Do they grieve over girlfriends? Huh? Do they grieve over girlfriends? Were you married to her? Was she your wife? Answer me! Look, Angel is dead and gone. Move on! Move on by giving me grandchildren! Mama, what's the problem? Oh, you learn a book on a on a on a, on a choke. What is it? We need to talk. Okay, hold on. See, I have come up with a plan. What plan? I want to get married to a former's daughter. That girl is a very nice girl. Well brought up. From a very good family. Her mother is a nice woman. So definitely anything from her can be anything less than good. Mama, I will find a wife for myself. Okay? You don't need to help me. Me, me, me on my own. When? When are you going to do this? Eh? For how many years now you've been saying the same thing? Since that girl died, you have refused to move on. I honestly don't know what you want me to say. Eh, Mama, what you are doing right now is just uncalled for. I will get married at God's appointed time. When is that appointed time? When is that appointed time? Eh, hey, Joshua? Look, let me tell you. This is the appointed time. This is the best time. Now that we are having this discussion, is the best time. Look, it's been so many years. You don't want to move on. Your mates are getting married. Having children. My mates are having four, five grandchildren. Joshua, I'm going to go. Hey. I'm going to stop now. What are you doing this for? What are you doing this for? Because stand up. I am not standing up. Stand up, stand up. Mama, don't do this. I'm begging you. I am not standing up on you until you promise me you are getting married very soon. Stand up. I'm begging you, please. I am not standing up. I am not standing up. You don't want to have, 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 have pity. Be have pity on me. You don't want to have pity on me. I am not standing up. I'll continue to kneel down like this. I will stand up because I will have. I will, I will get married and give you grandchildren. So many of them. It's just time. Just. Uh -huh. Are you sure? I'm very sure, Mama. Are you sure? Hey! Mama! 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 Is it one one? Sit down, sit down, sit down. Sit down. Yeah. Hey! Imagine, imagine you, hey. you came to wake me up. Look at the time. Does yeah. it matter? Does it matter? Yeah. Does it matter? I'm happy. Go, yeah. go and sleep. Hey, is it one one? I knew you would make me happy. I knew it! <laughs> My dear God. Don't let me cover you well. Or do you want to take something before no, you sleep? I'm fine, I'm fine. Are you yes. sure? Yes, yes. Ma when I sleep well, eh? Now I can go and have my own sleep. <laughs> Good night, oh. Oh, don't <laughs>
Okay, give me pound front, 200 naira. The young one, give me change. Madam, I told you I don't have change. I brought 1,000 naira. What do you buy? You don't have change. Now, Frank, go and look for change. Madam, drop my goods if you don't have change. Go and look for 200. I don't have change. Young girl, uh -uh. why are you talking to this woman like that? Don't you have respect? I didn't tell woman like this. Uh -huh. Eh? How much is the money? 200. Mama, don't worry. I'll pay for you. Oh, my daughter. God bless you. Amen. God will replenish your purse. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you. Oh. My daughter. Mama. <laughs> you are about going home now. Yes. Ah, thank you so much. No problem. God bless you. No problem. Whenever you took her that money from God will replenish it for you. Amen. You are such a good girl. Please, it will be my pleasure to meet you. It might also be my pleasure to meet you. I'm inviting you to my home. Yes. I so will want to meet you. Uh -uh. Uh, Mama, I'll, I'll think about You've it. You've already accepted. Hey. Just give me your number. Oh, um. All right. Give me zero your number. Zero. I'm coming. Huh. Two, two. Huh? Two, two again. Uh -huh. Four, one. Uh -huh. Three, one. Uh -huh. What is your name? Chuku Erika. Hi! Beautiful name for a beautiful girl. Uh -huh. I'm, I'll save it. Chuku Erika. My beautiful daughter. Mm -hmm. I've saved it. Okay, Mama. Bye. It's a good one. God bless you. Oh. Right. Bye bye, yo. Bye. Hey. Customer, customer. What's your day now? What do you get for me today? Give me my brand. Be a way cold. Well, well. Which brand? But I beg, get up, they go. Come on for here. You don't know your customer. Again. I beg, they come up from this place. I beg, which of you want very cold? Where you keep here for this fridge? I can pack yourself come up from my store, I beg. Your customer. This side they joke with you. Get out from this place, my friend. They go, they go, they go, they go, 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 I am paying you back in your own coin. What did it happen? Since morning, no single customer don't come buy something from my aunt today. Hey? Hey! Customers only they come every day. Now, what did it happen? God, I beg, go bring customers for me. I need money. I beg. I met at the market. Erika, my dear, this is my handsome son, Joshua Okechuku Mwafo. Hi, good afternoon. Uh, good afternoon, nice to meet you, Erika. Same here. Uh, my mom said so many good things about you. She said you rendered help to her, and I really do appreciate it. So, I'm going to show you how much I appreciate it. I'm coming. Joshua! Uh, 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 uh. So that you, both of you, can get acquainted with each other. You're welcome. Don't you. I'm actually preparing something for you. So I'll be right back. Well, I, I want to apologize. My mom can be very overbearing sometimes and, um, you know, she does the right thing at the wrong time, so I apologize. 
On the contrary, I think she's a nice woman. Oh. Okay. Well, I guess that leads me to uh, asking you what you would love to take. You want me to offer you anything to drink? Anything soft will do. All right, so just a minute. think it's too quick. We barely know ourselves. Ah, does it matter? Does it matter? You see, you can know somebody today and marry the person next week. It is called weak love. Mama, you really want your son to get married to me? Yes, because I love you. You are so beautiful. Thank you. I like your open teeth. <laughs> hey, remind me again. Where do you say you're from? Naze. Ah, Naze, you must listen. Yes, Mama. Hey, are you okay? I paid a visit to my husband-to-be. His late girlfriend ghost appeared and slapped me. The late girlfriend in question was your sister, Angel. What? Are you serious? Great Zanza, what do I do? I like this man in question. Besides, I never knew they were dating. Have to move in with him. They have a strong covenant. Once you sleep with him, she will never appear or disturb you again. And you have to move him through his mother. Hey, hey, great is Anza. How do I convince his mother that I want to move in with her son, a man I barely know? Take this. Take. Drink it. Visit his mother. Tell her you want to move in with her son. She will accept. Okay. Thank you, great Isanza.
Erica. Ah, so, to what do I owe this visit? I've come to stay. How do you mean you have come to stay? Yes, I've come to stay. At least spend time with Josh so we can get to know each other more better. Wait, you mean you are ready to move in now? Yeah, you have a problem with that? Oh, no, of course not. I don't have any problem with that. I, as, a fa as a matter of fact, this is one of the best news I've had in recent times. You're welcome. Thank Hold you. on, let me tell my son. Hey, get my bag. Didn't you hear that? Didn't you hear that instruction from your madam? Will you take that back? Set that if he married you, he met was a friend. Yes. Are you sure your son will like me? I'm a bit nervous. Why not? Look, don't be scared of anything. You are the best woman any man can ever ask for. You hit your sister with passion. Give me come with you. You go regret. Mara pa no ku na ke wara wa ne no wa. Anya na ke za za na ku si kwa yi. What is the fun here? Total package. Hmm. Akwa. Mama, Mama, I do not like this. I did not give my consent for that lady to enter into this house. But I told you, and I do not remember accepting. I do not remember accepting. Whether you accept it or not, she has come to stay. No one is going to make her leave this house, not even you. Mama. Papa. Mama. Papa. Papa Joshua. Or better still, Daddy Joshua, so that you know you're not getting any younger. What is your problem? Eh? Look, are you allergic to me? In our so mind. Eh? In our soul mind. Okay. Let's do it this way. Can she just go? Let her leave. When my mind is made up, then she can move in. Oh, mind. Are you sure this your mind is still functioning? Are you sure this your mind is still functioning? Are you speaking to me in this manner, Mama? Anyway. She's not leaving because I am not leaving. Okay. Mama. Have you even considered the security implications? Have you considered the health, her health issues? Who knows, this lady might even be epileptic. We have not even gone to check for our, our status to know if we even match. She might be SS and I'm ES. These things don't work like that. What if she dies here? I don't even know her parents. I don't know her siblings. It doesn't work that way. Who cares? Who cares? Look, I 
don't care if she has any of those health issues. I don't care. If she dies, then it will be on record that any woman that comes into your life dies. It seems I have to go. Go where? Look, you're not going anywhere. You will stay, get pregnant for my son, and give birth to my grandchildren. Yes. Get pregnant for your son. Mama, you should know who your son is by now. Josh will never touch me. Not to think of having children for him. Calm down. Calm down, Erika. This same Josh you're talking about is my son. So leave him for me. I don't have to handle him. Okay? Mama, are you sure? Ah, when you told me you were moving in, did I not agree with you? Did I not? So what makes you think I cannot handle this? Look, this is my show. I am the one calling the shots. So leave it for me. I know how to make him start loving you overnight. Yes. Okay, Mama, if you say so. Of course, let's go inside. Hmm. Assam. Ah, uh, what did you? Hi, fine girl. Erika, when you want to get up, Erika. Erika, hey, is this you? Oh, my God, you still love her, isn't it? But Mama, she keeps appearing to me. She made me promise never to ever leave her. I don't know, it just seems like there's a soul tie between me and her. Forget about any tie. Just get married now. And she will stop appearing to you. We are talking about a ghost here. How can you say that if I get married, everything will be in order? You think marriage is just going to make her stop appearing to me? Look, Erika is here. Erika is beautiful, intelligent, and well behaved. She's ready. It's not as if you're going to stand looking for a woman for you to marry. She is standing by waiting for you to just accept her. Perfect replacement. Just get married to her and she'll stop showing her face. And if she does, if you marry Erika and she comes back, I'll personally fight her. You will fight a ghost. Mama, do you know what you're talking about? <laughs> Joshua. Joshua, my son. It's obvious you don't even know the kind of mother you have. You think I'm an ordinary person. Look, I am a principality. I am strong spiritually. Let her try me and say. <laughs> <laughs> okay.
Why are you shouting? Did I bless you? Look, don't ever, don't ever repeat this thing you did now. Go try it ever in your life. Why are you shouting? Did I hurt you? I said, don't try what you're about to do now. Don't try it ever again in your life. What do you mean I should not try it ever again in my life? You are my husband, I am your wife. You're supposed to make love to me, it's my conjugal right. First, Force me to make love to you. Which man in his right senses will, will reject his wife on the night of their honeymoon? Which the man? The man that is going through what I'm going through will reject you. You know what I'm going through? What are you going through? I am going through a lot. If you are going through a lot, where I am coming from a lot. I forgive me that thing, my friend. Give me my property. I will force you. Yes, it's my right. Yes, I will force you. of our wedding. I forced a kiss on him. He ran into the toilet, spitting everywhere. Mama, do I have mouth odor? Oh, no. Don't say that. But, are you sure? Mama, I'm very sure what I'm saying. Even the kiss he gave to me, I fought him before he could give me the kiss. My husband avoids me like I have leprosy. Mama, I made a terrible mistake. I should have dated him before marrying him. Look at what I'm going through. I saw the red flag, but I deliberately ignored the red flag. Now look at what I'm going through. How can my husband avoid me on the night of our wedding, Mama? That everything is under my control. Are you hearing me? Just relax. You don't need to bother yourself about anything. He is my son. I, I know how to handle him. Wipe your tears. I want to assure you that this is the last time you will ever experience this kind of rejection and refusal from him again. Are you hearing me? Wipe your tears. Don't worry, I'm here for you. Hmm? You can always count on me. Always. It's alright, my dear. My beauty. It's alright. I hope you don't feel bad, right? I miss you very much. I miss you even more. This... This is very hard on me. I understand. Let's try one more time. Josh, are you okay? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. <laughs> Mama? Mama? <laughs> Jesus, 
I begin to take authority over every foul spirit that is working against my son's marital settlement. By the power in the name of Jesus Christ, I come against your power. You forces of darkness from the water, from the sea, from the river, from the land, from the air, I command you in the name of Jesus Christ. Scatter now, scatter now, scatter now, scatter now. Mama, 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 my husband has started again. What is it? He talks to himself alone, laughs, he's even kissing the air. Hey. Oh, come and see. Holy oh, Ghost fire, devil, you are a liar. Devil, you are a liar. Magadaga, go, satire, magadaga. Kichuku, are you okay? Eh? Who were you talking to? Mama, you were supposed to actually knock. That's what the door is meant for. You knock. Is that too hard to do? I don't know what can happen with that thing. Eh? I'm talking about something important. Now I can't knock before you enter. Who were you talking to? Mama, I was not talking to anybody. Besides, this is my room. I can do whatever I want to do in my own room. Okay? And if you must know, I was rehearsing. Rehearsing for what? Rehearsing? Is that why you've been laughing so hard? Yes. Hmm. Okay, Chuku. This is not normal. I'm with my cord. I don't understand what you mean. I'm normal. Hmm. This is not normal. Oh, Kuche get the require. Kuche get there. Kuche get the require. Kuche get there. Ne. You heard him. He was rehearsing for the seminar. Hmm. So please, you have nothing to worry about. Okay. Just stay with your husband. I'm preparing dinner. Once dinner is ready, I'll call both of you to come and eat. Oh, mom. Nah, you check it require. You check Start eating together. I want my food brought up to my room now. Joshua, a family that eats together stays together. I want breakfast, lunch, and dinner to be done here like one big happy family. That's how I raised you up, remember? Well, mother, things are done differently here. And I want my dinner served in my room. I don't understand you these days. This is not how I raised you. You are totally a different person now. Enough, mother! I have had it up to here. Okay? I am still the same Josh that you know. But I'm just a young man who does things privately. And I will not eat at the same table with this woman. Oh, really? your privacy and that includes talking to an invisible object, right? I will not be insulted, mother. Okay? I want my dinner served in my room. Unless you don't want me to have dinner tonight, and then that's fine.
So, who is this for? It's for I'm taking it to his room. Oh, good girl. Let me help you. No, don't worry, Ma. You can go to Let bed. me have it. Now, go and sleep. You want to go and sleep? Your I mates are already asleep. Go and sleep. Uh -uh. Are you kerosene? Hey, Mama. Are you still standing there? No, Ma. Go no.
mama coming. I brought you orange juice, my favorite. Thank you very much. Will I ask your mama to bring it? Ah, must it be your mama? Eh? You wanted her to bring your food to your bedroom. Now you want her to bring juice. Okay, I brought it. Are you not going to drink it? Mama, please, I'm begging you. Don't even go there. Don't, don't, please, don't do that. Okay, drink up. I'll, 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 I'll drink up when I want to. No, I will not live until you drink it. Mama, I will drink it when I want to drink. You, 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 you won't force me to drink it now, please. You refuse to eat my food. Are you also going to refuse to drink juice? Eh? I'm not living until you drink it. I am waiting, oh. Is that all? You, you said I should just drink it. I should drink small. I no. drank it now. Mm -mm. There was no small in what I said. I said drink up. Oh, which means you're still angry with me. I'm oh, not angry with you. I'm, uh, please, I just want to be by myself. Be cool. No, no, leave until you drink. my legs hmm? okay I'm happy now okay I'm good night go let me now go let me now go and sleep hmm? I'm a good night I'm a good night Let that thing not come close. 
to me. No! 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 no. Let me see how you will ever come close to my son again. Nonsense. When you get to the land of the dead, tell them you met a stronger woman, a principality that is unbreakable. Nonsense. Positive result. Is that clear? Now, go and do the needful. <laughs> I know you're shy. <laughs> Alright, enjoy yourself. Hello? Hello? Hello, wake up. Wake up. Hello? Stand up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. Did you touch me? Yes, now why? You took advantage of me. Which one you took advantage? I had a taste of you. Are you not my husband? Oh my god. Didn't you enjoy it? Because I did. You know, I was waiting for you to wake up so I can compliment you. Ibu machine. German machine. Odogu. Now you be. Hi! You know what? Now that you are awake, your eyes are opened. Let me do the second round. Tell me what. Are you okay? Are you normal? Which one is are you normal? Please you give me my property. I want to do second Respect round. Yourself. Give it to me. What? Respect yourself. See what you do. See what you did today, you will regret it. I promise you, you will regret it. I am so sorry, my lord. I am. I don't 
know what happened. I don't know what came over me. It was your mother's doing. My mother's doing? How, how do you mean? She used charm on you and everywhere in the house. As it stands now, I can't even assess the house again. Oh, you knew about it? And you did nothing about it? You did not even try to stop her? How could I have done something when my hands were tied? Why would my mother even do a thing like that? She believes you're possessed. And because of this, I am so angry at you right now. You will have to beg to see me again. No, don't say that. Listen to her. Who are you talking to? How is it even your business who I was talking to? Are you okay? Why would you watch to my office like that? Are you normal? Oh, let, 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 let me understand right now. So you think because we are friends, you won't respect me any longer, right? I said I'm sorry. The door was not locked. Then I decided to peep. Oh, you peeped. Now you're monitoring me in my own office. You've all of a sudden forgotten that I'm the CEO of this organization, right? No, 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 no. George, get out. Please calm down, please. I said get out. Just get Girls don't prepare the stuff. Yes, ma'am. Okay, you can go. You don't need us to assist you with any other thing. No, I'm fine. Thank you. Okay, ma'am. Of soup on the fire. The next thing I saw, the soup, the pot, everything was on the floor. Mama, there's a spirit in this house. <laughs> Shut up. What do you mean by there's a spirit in this house? Are you the one that came with the spirit? So, what do you mean? You're supposed to be a strong woman. Huh? A strong woman. A strong woman, that's what you should be. How can you be running like that when no one is pursuing you? I think you're hallucinating. Mama, I know what I saw, but if you think I am hallucinating, then I believe you. Of course. Because you didn't see anything. Okay, now go back to your cooking. Hmm? Go back to the kitchen. Come back well. If you hear should go to the kitchen and continue from where I stopped. There is no way I am going there. Or better still, you can go to the kitchen and cook. After all, you're a woman like me. Don't you have hands like me? Please, oh, I'm not going there. Ah. Oh. to call God's name. While lying. You on your jaw. How can you say this, Mama? Do you know what this has cost me? But I did not do anything. You did something. Pray. Pray that she forgives me because I will. 
will not find it funny with you. I will not have it easy with you. She? Yes! Who, who is she? Hey, hey, Erika, Erika is upstairs now. Who, who is she? Joshua, what are you saying? I said so. I have, I have done all sorts of evil to you, but please, forgive me. It is not my making, please. Forgive me. Joshua, what are you saying now? Please, Angel, appear to me wherever you are. Okay, Joshua. Appear to me wherever you are. I am sorry. I am sorry. I am sorry. I am to my son. Mama. Ah! Joshua. Have mercy. Forgive me. Please. Forgive me. You want to ruin my life. You want to render me useless. How can you do this? But I did not do Mama, it. Mama, how can you drug me? I, I, I did not do anything. Ah! Angel, please, wherever you are, I am nothing without you. My son has nothing without you. Please, forgive me, Mama. Please, my son has lost forgive it. me. I love you very much. My son has lost it. So would you too have cost me? Ah! My son has lost it. My son has lost it. Mama. Mama, I think my husband is raving mad. Hey! Come back. You know what? Lock the door. Here. Let me get rope and tie him up. Here. 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 I don't know, you should be asking my mother and my wife because I don't understand why they brought me to a psychiatric hospital. Well, uh, according to them, you were talking to yourself. Look, Doc, it is just um, an attitude that I display anytime I am extremely angry. It's nothing serious. Oh, I see. Well, um, madam, your son is fine. You don't need to bother yourself. But if you're not satisfied yet, you can bring him to us anytime you want. Yes, or better still, we can fix an appointment with a psychologist. Okay. If I do. It's fine. It's okay. I'll be in my office. Thank you so much, doctor. Can I go home now, please? Can I come go home? You sure can't. We will go. Let's, let's, let's talk first. The doctor said I'm okay. Can we go home? Please, can we go home? Erika, I want to do what we should do first. Let's go now, see the doctor says it's okay. All right, Joshua. Sure. Let's go. 
Introducing you to him. Eureka, let's let's go after him before he won him. Has entered you, Erika. You have sold your soul to the devil. You hate your sister with passion. Give me call me radio, Chukwe Erika. Bara kwa nuku na ke wara wara nenua. Anya na ke zamzam na fushi kwa ike. What do you stand to gain in all this wickedness? Remember, judgment day is coming on. Papa, Papa, Rocky, Chukwe, Rika. Papa, I went so to the police. Oh, oh, oh. He made me wabo. Papa, Rocky, Erika. Papa, I went so to the police. Oh, oh, oh. He made me wabo. Oh, Papa, Rocky, Chukwe, Rika. Papa, I went so to the police. Mama, I think I'm sick. For how long? I think it's for a while now. I've been feeling very feverish lately. I don't didn't... know. My body is just doing me somehow. And you didn't mention it to me. Wait. Have you been feeling well? Yes. Are you sure? What did you eat this morning? Mama, I ate rice. Rice? Okay, you know what? Lie down. Hmm? Yes. Just lie down. It. You are not expecting it. You missed it, right? Then you have missed it forever. It is not coming. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Hey, <laughs> What is it? Your wife is pregnant. Yes. 
You are about to be called a father. Are you serious? Yes. <laughs> God has answered our prayer. Hmm? Your, your mother is about to carry her grandchild. Lekuya. Olandia. Asamo. Oyoyom. Ugobenja Fuso. Oh, Kennedy. Josh. I know you feel nothing for me. I know you don't love me. But please, I'm begging you, for the sake of our unborn child, let us have this baby in peace. you but I don't hate you either okay you must know. I hate her. I hate her so much. I hate everything she represents. But you know she is carrying my child. Do you want her to miscarry? Wouldn't that be better? Are you serious? You think it's better for me to lose my child? You know I want this child very much. How can you do this? You want me to lose this one? I'm jealous. I don't want anyone around you. She's taking your, your attention away from me. I don't want her to have your child, neither do I want her anywhere around you. Angel, I love you very much, but we cannot continue to do this. We cannot be together. Don't you see it? We are worlds apart. I'm in a different world. You're in a different world. I cannot even access your world. Josh, can you even hear yourself speak at all? We've been together up until now. What changed? Well, what changed is that my wife is pregnant now. And I want this child. I mean... I can't continue to do this with you. People think I'm abnormal. I go out and I talk to myself. And people think I'm abnormal. How much? How long do I, do I need to continue like this? I cannot do this any longer. I want this child. My mother wants this child. Why are you being so selfish? Josh, why are you being so selfish? So now, it's, it's all about you. It's all about your mother and what you want. What about me? What about me? Is this the love you promised me? You promised together forever. Why are you doing this to me? I promise you, but I cannot keep this promise anymore. Oh. I cannot. I am sorry. Think about it. I cannot. We can continue to do this forever. I, I need the touch of a woman. A woman needs to touch me. Don't you get it? I cannot get this. I can never ever get this, George. Stop telling me this. You're breaking my heart. Are breaking my soul. I need to be a great father to my unborn child as much as I also need to be a good husband to Erica. Oh. That will never happen. I will not let that happen, Josh. I won't. Can you leave me with no choice but to choose between you and my child? And I choose my child. Josh. I choose to have a child. Josh. Josh, you can do this. Josh! No! 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 
No. So what happened to you? You didn't go to work today. I actually did, but I had very little to do, so I thought it wise to come spend some time with you. Very thoughtful of you. <laughs> Thank you so much. So where would you want me to take you to? Just name any restaurant of your choice and I'll take you there. Or would you rather we go to your house today? You're asking the wrongest person. I, I really do not know my way around here. You know better, so just take me anywhere you want. And at the end of the day, they drop me home. Okay, darling. Right. No problem. You have to give me a couple of minutes to okay. round this up and then we'll leave. That's fine. <laughs> you look very beautiful, by the way. You. <laughs> You're welcome. You made me blush. Aww. <laughs> you think you have a lot to do? Yes. Her name was Angel. Angel was a good girl and a good friend to my son. You can't see Josh anywhere without seeing Angel. They were so much in love. So much that I concluded their love was made in heaven. They looked so good together that I couldn't help but just admire them. Until one fateful day, a tragedy struck. I got a call from my son that Angel was in the hospital. I rushed down to the hospital immediately. But before I got there, it was too late because Angel was gone. She was gone to the great beyond. It was a huge loss. So much that since then, my son has not gotten over it. So the man I am married to 
is still in love with a ghost. And you expect me to still continue staying in this house, mama? You see what I'm saying? You see, until I die first, I should be out of this place by now, mama. Mama, please. I'm going to get my things. No, give me this. Erika, come back. Erika. What is it? I saw her. Saw who? Your dead girlfriend. She was trying to kill me. George, I think I need to leave this house. That girl has plans to kill me. No. Please, don't leave. Okay? I... I want to give love a chance again. And I want to do this with you. Please. I beg you, don't leave. Please. She's here. The door just, just closed by itself. She's here. I'm very sure about this. Oh my goodness. Josh, she's here. You promised never to leave me. You promised to love me forever. You promise that no one can ever take my place. Now tell me, what went wrong? What happened? All this while, I have lived for you. I did everything that you've ever asked me to do. I did all your beings. And now that I want to start living my life, you can't take it? I can't take it! I cannot take it, Josh! You want to start living with my arch enemy? I cannot take this! I can't! I just have the decency to keep to your promise! I won't! I cannot keep to that promise anymore! I can't! Josh! I, no, I can't do it anymore! Okay? I have, I have a life to live and I will live that life! I have Erica now, and I will not lose her to you, okay? We are worlds apart, so leave! Ah! No! Josh, she's the one you've been talking to, right? She's the one. I told you to let me go. This girl is on a mission. She wants to kill me. I will not let you. She wants to take my life. Let me go, please. Erica, I wouldn't want her to hurt my child and I. Let me go. I beg you. No. I cannot let you go. Okay? I cannot continue to live like this. I cannot continue to live in fear. Let me go, no, please. I can't, Erica. I'm sorry. I cannot. Josh. No, I can't. I'm sorry. What? Are you okay? No, 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 I, I, I feel pain. Come, come Are you sure she's not done something to my child? No, no, she hasn't. She hasn't. Just come and sit. Come. Come, we have to sit. Josh, come. we are both living in fear. Can't you see? She will not bother you anymore. Are you sure? I am very sure, okay? Just come. It's fine. It's fine. It's, it's okay. Are you sure she's not she, somewhere around? Sweetheart, trust me. Erica, just trust me.
where exactly? You belong to me and I belong to you, so what are you talking about? I don't want you in my life. I know that mother loved your life. You are no longer the love of my life! No more! You lie. I am still the love of your life. I own you, Josh! Leave! My patience, leave! Don't you ever take that woman into our room. Don't you ever do that. Do not disrespect me. Do not disrespect the love we share, Josh. Don't. Josh. Josh. Josh, is she gone? Talk to me. She's gone. I told you, I told you she came to kill me. She didn't. Josh, let me go, please. I cannot let you go. Please, let's go. You need to lie down, okay? Please.
hands are tied. I can't possibly do anything about it. Take me out of here. Angel, 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 angel. Good day, good day. A quick ring, Baba.
you almost killed me. How could you run over me? If I were alive, you would have killed me. I mean, I would have been dead by now. You are dead already. And just give me space, please. I will never give you space. You belong to me, body and soul. I will not. I'd rather die. I'd rather kill myself than to give you space. Must I remind you again? I said you were dead. Even at that, being dead has not changed anything. It hasn't changed the, the, the love we have. It has not changed it. I was at your office and I told you everything, what they did in your house. It's enough you to get there and throw them out. What did you do? You went home and lost your mind. Please, please. This is, is what? What kind of a man I've are you? I've enough of all of this. Like, I cannot do this anymore. My car just broke down here now and I'm trying to fix it. And here you are, blocking my life. What car? What are you talking about? I just said something to you. I told you what you were supposed to do at home. You went there and, and did what? I'm disappointed at you. I mean, who does that? I cost it. And I will even do more. You see this car? <laughs> Let me see you move it there. You're not going anywhere. You're going to be stuck here with me. You did what? I cost it. I did all. And I will do more. You want me to, to release the car so that you can go home to that evil girl? It will never happen. Let me see you move. All the promises, the love you once showed me. You almost killed me. Oh, goodness. <laughs> and you want me to die and die and die and die? Even to kill my spirit? Oh, you never loved me. I see that. But I will never stop loving you. You're not going anywhere. You're stuck here with me today. Here is the orange. I want you to lick it very well. Possible finish all of them. It's good for the baby. So? Mom, I'm not comfortable. Can you peel for your, by yourself out? You want me to peel for you? Well, I'll, I'll peel it. Don't worry, don't worry. Let me give it to you. No, don't worry. It's an exercise. Mm. Upstairs, I just needed to come and attend to you. Okay. I'll be back. All right, Mama, thank you. Going in and coming out. Uh, I don't understand you, what's going on. What do you mean by that? If your stomach is normal. Um, before you came downstairs, it was inside. It, went, it was flat as if I was never pregnant. Are you sure? Yes, Mama. I know what I'm saying. Erika, calm down. You are too scared. Okay? Relax. There's no problem. Just relax. I'm not scared. I know what I saw. Okay, let me sit down. Let me watch it. Let me see if it will come, go down again. You see? 
see. It's normal. Nothing is happening. My, my child is fine. No, nothing will happen to this child. This is my first grandchild. Nothing whatsoever. Hmm? Relax. Okay, bring your ring. Let me pay for you. Relax your back. For that accept though. See I forgot I got Madame Jay now. For don't carry your own. I go Ronaldo you now. Score go. Everything go the apple. You know now. See, it be like say you did Chris. Me? Like this where I did. Eh? Like this, you don't look me finish. I resemble get man food. Nice. I resemble person where few roll with you. It be like say you did. See, if woman they hungry, eh? Open this gate. Go that junction. You can see twelve women. God they are go carry your choice. See, no, no, they insult me. Maybe because I say men make they work together and I can't do show like say. Because you see me, we are black and white. Okay, that's where you talk to you. If you accept okay, me. Okay, I know they touch me. If you, if you accept me, see eh, it. Eh. <laughs> you don't get ever, you don't get ever the better. Mama, help me. Okay, mother. So, all of you are here. Mama, I'll be shouting at this. Eh? Oh, oh you see, children. Mama, wait. Oh, God. Mama. Go so get the khaki, go get the khaki, quickly. Ah! No, 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 no. Sorry, sorry now. Wait, oh, wait, Mama. Oh, this khaki, who will drive the moto? Why go taxi? Why go taxi? Stupid boy! Get out! I don't bring the car. I will slap you if you don't get out of here. Run! Look for taxi! All of you can look for taxi. Madam, what did they do you? Sorry, sorry, sorry. Don't bring taxi! Come now! Bring it your mouth. Bring it your mouth. Bring it your mouth. Um, Philip, please take this file. Go through it very well. I need you to proofread. And after you've done that, make sure you log into the system. It has to be sent to the exact company by okay. 12 noon. Okay. Alright? Please do. Thank you, right. Hello, Mama. What is it? What is it? What's the problem? Oh, um, so take her to the hospital. Um. Okay, this is what you're going to do. Just, um, Look for a cab um, and then take her to the hospital. I'll meet you all immediately. Okay, okay, okay. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Just give me a few minutes, alright? Boss, is everything okay? Yes, everything is fine. My, my wife is just in labor, okay? And then I'm coming with you? No, 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 Caleb, you don't have to. Go to your office, make sure this is done, and then um, I will um, call you so that we can sort things out, okay? I'll see you soon. She's my love. Congratulations, a very big congratulations to you. You are now a father. Hey! <laughs> yes. Yes! <laughs> Thank you so much, Doctor. Thank you. How is my wife? Oh, mother and son doing great. So you can go in and see them. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I will come to your office and see you. No problem. Thank you so much. 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 Thank you. I don't know what's 
what's wrong with men? You change so easily. None have been replaced. You don't even care about me anymore. Sweetheart. I thought that you might need this to calm your nerves. Did you say sweetheart? Josh, you just said sweetheart? Yes, I noticed that you are. You've been feeling really uneasy for some time, so. What is this? What is this? Hey, look at me! Hey, look at this! Josh, you won't try that! Hey, hey, what are you trying to do? Are, is this how you have just forgotten me? Josh, you're so wicked! Look at her! Look, listen, Josh! Josh, you can't be doing this to me! Don't! See, my love? Who? Who are you calling your love? He is not your love! Josh! Josh! What? 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 You don't, whatever you're doing, don't touch this woman. I'm warning you, and I mean every word of it. Do you understand? I don't want to get angry with you. Hey, hey, hey. Don't do that. I'm sorry about how I treated you. I'll change. Josh. Ah! Josh! Laugh for once. Sometimes I wonder how you became my friend. Look, if you have something important to say, just go ahead and say it. I'm a very busy person. <laughs> Josh, do you know you have changed a lot? How do you mean? You no longer talk to yourself or fight the air. You're more coordinated now than before. What is the secret? Well, I guess marriage changes people. Marriage. That's what happened, yeah. How? I'm a lot more focused on my marriage now. <sighs> that is good. At least I can see a lot of improvement in you. You're no longer a psycho. I'm not a what? <sighs> Go ahead, finish your statement. I'm not a what? I'm so sorry, I don't mean to offend you. I have to take my leave. See what I was trying to show you? If we follow this draft, huh, we are on our way to success. Um, well, 
I think we need a little adjustment in order to achieve it easily. I did what I would have done a long time ago. I burnt your late girlfriend's clothes. You did what? Ah, what? Ah, what did you do? Ah! My dad finally stopped it! What did you do? Hey! What did you do? Consign me. And then Sabi, my own to Open, close. If I'm hungry, you give me. See, I want to make I believe tell you, say. Agree to what I tell you. Huh? If they don't do their own now, we're gonna do our own. These are the past time. You know now. You don't say you the crazy. So for this serious matter now, waiting there your mind now. Make it to, to check you woman. Abi, now waiting there your mind. Maybe if there's people transfer the madness come where you take, you won't come. Agree, with. make I help your life. Agree, you know, agree. I don't tell you before, say you know be my type. Get man. You're not my type. I dare you have a good food. Finish! I am finished, Mr. Kukum! You have killed me. Joshua, what is the problem now? Is it not just ordinary club that she burnt? Give me my call of my mother. Eh? I'm finished. Joshua. Give me my call of my mother. Joshua, calm down. What will I tell my mother? Down now. I'm yes. here. What is the problem? She it was just clothes that she bought. It wasn't even your own clothes that she bought. I have killed myself. Eh? I'm not in human form. 
What do you mean? Sit down, sit down, calm down. Let's talk about it. Eh? Sit down, sit down first. I'm finished. Joshua. Joshua, why are you acting like this? I killed myself. Eh? I am not in human form. Eh? I'm not in human form. Joshua, what are you trying to say now? What is the problem now? Can you tell me about it? I'm finished. Huh? I've killed myself. I killed myself totally. Joshua, what is wrong with you now? Huh? Why are you behaving like this now? Joshua, somebody help me out! Erica! Inoma! Ngachi! Somebody come on! Ngachi! Somebody come and help me out! Joshua, why are you behaving like this now? What is wrong with you? It's a bad I went out. I... Who took my child now? He's supposed to be here, Mama. Have you asked him, Mama? Have you asked her? No. crying so I took him downstairs. Please go. You can go. Hey. Erika. Erika, you can be scared for 
I'm laughing. Please breastfeed him now. I'll be in my room. Mama, he is. He needs help. I know the condition I, I met him when I came in. Joshua, can you talk to me? Joshua, mom, can you talk to me? Uh, you know what? There's a man of God I know. I am going to bring him. But before then, let's pray. Let's pray. Joshua, give me a hand. Give me. Father, in the name of Jesus. Amen. You did not give me a mad, a madman as a son, Father. Oh. Any power. Mm. That is smoking against the life of my son. I come against it in Jesus. Amen. Oh. You have spirit of madness. In the name of Jesus, I rebuke you out of this life. Amen. Lose your hose right Amen. now. Lose your hose right Amen. now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Infirmity. I command you to lose your hose for my son. Amen. Lose your hose. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Joshua, okay, I declare you totally made whole. In the name of God the Father. In the name of God the Son. find ourselves on the road. I, I don't know. I'm lost here. What do you mean you are lost here? We need to find a solution, no? Because I strongly believe that something is wrong with you. Something is wrong with me? How do you mean? Maybe your dead girlfriend wants to kill you. Because how else did we find ourselves sleeping on a busy road? happens to us? What if a car had killed us?
Hello. Please, I'm here to see your boss. My boss? Yes. Okay, let me tell my madam that you're here. It's okay. Hello. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. So what do I owe this visit? Oh, nothing. I'm here to see Josh. Well, Josh is not around. He stepped out a few minutes ago. I don't think so. He tested me to come to his house and pick up some fire needed for the production. It's urgent. He tested you? Oh, yes. We have been communicating so well for some time now. So he said he would be working from home for a while. What time did he test you? Oh, he just tested me now. Asking if I'm around so I can pick up the files. Okay. You can come in. He needs help. I, I, I can't leave him like it's this. Okay. Are you, look, if you don't leave now, I'll call the security on you. Can you leave? No guesses. What do you consider riches and madness? See, make I tell you, 
I'm gonna be the first rich madman who I know. Wait though, you should say no be just be this. Because why you can't get money? Cut the mad on top. Let's see the truth. Coro no moon aka. I say clear for yourselves. Are you deaf? Clap for yourselves. Who is mad? Ah, nobody, nobody, nobody ma. Answer me now. Who is mad? Nobody is mad. Oh, really? Are you not calling me a liar? No. Because I heard you loud and clear. Oh, has it got into you both? Standing in your witch gathering and making my son a subject of discussion. No, Ma. Ma, we're not talking we're about not... your son. No. We're, we're not talking about him. Shut up! You know what? Both of you should go pick your things and get out of this room. Hey. Mama, we're please, sorry. We're, we're sorry. sorry. We're sorry. We are 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 sorry. I am going to pardon the both of you for now. But next time I hear you again say anything against my son, you will you will not only really lose your job. I will hand you over to the police. Hey! Thank you, ma. Where are you going to? I'm going to work. Dressed like this? Yeah. Baby, please. You can't go to work like this. Let's go inside. Why? You are sick. You may cause problems to people on the way. Oh, no, no. That's not true. I'm fine now. Trust me. I'm very good, my baby. No, you're not. Sweetheart, let me go to work. No. Why are you doing this? I beg you. Let's go inside. No, I'm fine. Josh. What's the problem? You're not fine. Look at me. Hello, God! What are you saying? I'm going to go to work. Let me go to work. Look at me. Come on. Look at my Brown skin boy. Come on. Look at that baby, man. Come on. Let me go to work. Come on, baby. Hmm? You can't. You can't. Don't do this. Oh, you, oh, you want to join me to work? Okay, let's go together. Jo Josh, go, Josh, go, go. Josh, Josh, please. Oh, stop doing no. this now. Oh, God. I'm wasting. I'm wasting here. Josh, don't do this to me. What, what am I doing to you? You want me to walk? Let's go to work. You hurt yourself and hurt other people. Me? You, you need to go inside. Looking like this? I'm going to hurt people? Yes. Okay, yeah, yeah, I understand. I'm too hot, yeah. <laughs> no problem. I understand. I know I, I know what you meant. I'm too hot. Like, you feel that good? I'm going to hurt people. But well, that's not true. Josh, Josh. Come Josh. on. Okay, no. Josh, what do you want to do? Josh! Yourself oh my God. Like this. Oh no, come on, let me go to work. That's the wrong position for you. Calm down. Okay, let me drive you. Give me the key. Please. Oh. Let me go to work. Come on. I'm sure people want to see me at the office. Let me go to work. Gosh, no. I'm wasting here. I'm wasting here. I'm languishing here. Come on. Let's go inside. Please, let me take care of you. Honestly, I don't know what to do. It's as if the whole world is crumbling on my head. He is not getting any better. He is still sick. I'm exhausted. Oh, I... What do you think I should do? What are you insinuating? Look, if you were in my shoes, you would not even be saying these things you're saying now. I'm fed up.
Yes. Why are you both going to with your bags? Madam, you know they walk again. No? Me, I won't go. I won't go before I go bite person here and one day go fly and they go. Me, I don't want to walk again. No? Yes, so. Now, so you, you take person the other day, it won't break my head. Me, I don't want to die. I still won't leave. I beg. Don't worry. You girls go inside. I have called a psychiatric doctor. He'll be here soonest. Everything will be fine. Madam, I know they walk again. I know I don't want to walk. Madam. We, we, we are, our mind is made up. We know they walk again. I beg. I don't get it. You both have grown wings and you now talk back at me. Really? I insist you go inside else I will deal with you. No, 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 no extra pay and no salary. So go. I don't want to go now. You don't get money. I want to go. You never pay us for this month though. And the month don't almost end. I beg. You give us money. Make me put come up for this house. When you both are done, get yourselves out of my compound. I don't go pay us now. Make me go now. You don't see what's in this one. Come and pay us. Make me go. No one go. I want to go. 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 imagination you never believed that a day like this would come right go away I don't have any business with you you lie we have blood ties you are my sister but you chose to allow jealousy eat deep into you and separate us for what gain if I may ask well tell me we are not sisters oh we can never be you are not blood related. You are not my father's biological daughter. Angel, you have always wanted all that belonged to me. You took everything that I have. I am not letting you have your way this time around. Ever wondered why I never told Josh that you're my blood sister? Ever wondered? Ever wondered why I never told him? That you are my killer. Ever wondered? <laughs> that is because I've been watching you. I've been watching you from a distance. I've been watching you do a whole lot of things. I've been watching you play your games. And I was actually waiting for the right time. But I'm here now to let you know the two can actually play the game. Mm. I am going for your child. No! Angel, please. Please don't hurt my child. Catch me if you can. <laughs> Junior! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh. Junior! 
angel. That's my child. An innocent child. When I told you that two can actually play this game, you thought I was joking, right? Was I not innocent when you sniffed life out of me? Chukwemika. What did I ever do to you? How did I ever go wrong? All I ever did was to love you. Chukwemika, I fought for you. I was there for you. I made sure no one hurt you. I took good care of you. I loved you so much. We had sisterly bond. But how did you pay me back? You killed your own blood sister. And you're here saying what? And you're saying what? You're saying that? It's an innocent child. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, forgive me, please. I know I wronged you. Please forgive me. Please. You know, I can actually have mercy because indeed the child is innocent. But I'm sorry, dear sister of mine, that bond we had is broken. It is too late. The game just began. after an innocent child. Then what business of yours is it? I'm in my world. Leave me be. Oh, I will not leave you. Because you are fighting the wrong cause. I am not fighting the wrong cause. I know exactly what I'm doing. Who are you anyways? What do you know? You have no idea of what my sister did to me. She sniffed life out of me, took over my man, married him, had a child for him. And as if that was not enough, 
she changed my spirit. Now I have broken loose. I will make sure that I take everything that belongs to me that she has. So stay off this. Grudges. Grudges are for those who believe that they are actually holding something. But forgiveness on the other hand are for those who are substantial enough to move on. What you don't understand, young woman, is that hatred cannot be isolated. The choices you've made has lost its logical meaning even in the realm of the spirit. So I will implore you to please hand the child over to me and fight the right cause. Please. No! No! I will do no such thing. Don't make me feel like I'm doing any bad thing. You have no idea of what I've been through. You have no idea of what I've faced. Don't remind me of that. Don't make me feel like a bad person. I'm just trying to revenge. I haven't done anything wrong. I love my sister. I love her so much. What did I get in return? If I don't do this, my spirit will never be happy. Just leave me alone. Please. Man of God, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Please, calm down. You really need to calm down. Revenge are for unbelievers. As I was told, please forgive your sister. But first of all, this child that is in your custody is innocent of everything, any fight you are at for. Please, I implore you, innocent child's life is at stake. You on the innocent child so that you can go ahead and fight the right cause. Please, I implore you once again, kindly hand over the little child to me. My baby, Peter, can I have my baby? Please. Calm down, please calm down. Your baby is safe as you can see. It's all right. Okay, you can have it. <laughs> Madam, if I may ask, what happened? What what happened? Never mind. Hallelujah, Father. Thank you for this. Thank you for your wonderful work. You have really proven that you are the creator of heaven and earth. He who knows all things. The author and finisher of every life. So, May you be glorified. Thank you. Thank you. So where did you find my baby? I think the question should be... Never mind. Please. Where is your husband? He's where he's being treated. Where is your house? Let me take you there. You brought this upon yourself and your household. What will it profit a man to gain the whole world and lose his soul to the devil? Absolutely nothing. Pastor, please help me. I have sinned against God and I have sinned against man. So this incident has taught me a thorough lesson. Help me, Pastor. I don't want to lose my life and that of my child. Please. You have indeed sinned against God and humanity. But do not forget that the warfare is not for the carnal minded. We will need to go back to the roots where it all began. Yes. 
be wired. Let us pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, Amen. you said in your word that you will forgive us our sins, no matter how dark they appear to be. You're fine, but you're not. Please come inside. You're not fit to go out. I know I am fit to go out. How long will I continue to stay inside the house? I have a lot of work to do. Baby, please now. Don't do this. Come inside. Please. <laughs> And so you lie. I lie not. He's mine. He can't be yours. I rebuke you in the name of Jesus. Amen. You evil. I command you to disappear. Amen. Disappear. Amen. I rebuke you. Amen. I rebuke you. Amen. I rebuke you. I rebuke you, devil. In the name of Jesus Christ.
Thank you. We are here to pick my husband. Hope all is well. All is well. As a matter of fact, it's urgent. This is my pastor. But madam, you know your husband is undergoing spiritual cleansing. And it's risky if you take him out of here. Child of God, you don't have to be afraid. For the Lord has assured us in the book of Matthew, chapter 8, verse 20, that where two or three are gathered, that he is right there in their midst. For as long as we have unanimously agreed in one heart, the Lord will not shame us. Amen. All right. If you insist, come with me. Thank you. Yes, that bondage needs to be broken. Amen. If not, she will take your life. Hmm. Hey. Yes. Oh, Please, we have to go. We have to make it fast. Josh! Josh! Where are you going to? I want to ease myself. Now? I should ease myself again. No, no, you can't ease yourself now. Let's go back. You want to back. help me ease myself? You want to help me? Okay, go. Hey! Josh! Josh! Hold him up! Hold him for me! Hold him for me! Josh! Hold back! Hold back! Josh! Why are you running? Leave me alone! Leave me alone! This is my property! His body is mine! He is mine forever. Leave me alone. You unforgiving spirit, I command you by the power conferred on me to leave this body in the name of Jesus. Amen. Leave this body in the name of Jesus. Amen. Leave this body in the name of Jesus. Amen. I run the fire of Holy Ghost upon you. This body is the vessel of God. Yes. It does not belong to you. There is no room for you in here. Leave this body Amen. in the name of Amen. Jesus. Leave this body in the name of Jesus. Amen. Leave this body in the name of Jesus. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Are you all doing here? We are here to reclaim our possessions. What possessions are you talking about? Were you not the same person that said I should fight the right cause? So why are you here blabbing in my territory? Oh, but you are fighting it wrongly. How am I fighting it wrongly? How? When she is the architect of everything that happened. Talk. She's right. Angel was my sister. I killed her out of out of envy. Hmm. 
Great Ivanka. Apa tagum? Ayo no se meka ne me. Kuna se meme. Agai me. Great Izanza of Udume land. I greet you. Welcome to the shrine of Great Izanga. Mm. Drop the gift of Great Izanga. Now, what do you want the Great Izanza to do for you? Great Izanza, I am here because of my sister. She's living a life of luxury while I'm in the ghetto, suffering, selling hot drinks and cigarettes. She doesn't care about me. So what do you want me to do to her? Great is answer. I want her dead. Eliminate her. She is the reason for my predicament today. You want her dead? Yes. Great is answer. We heard her. Grant her her wish. I want to run Bafunanya, I want to run Bafunanya. Hmm, I think we're the laborers. The great is Anza, him and we're the banana orri. My canero can hear you, Dele. I thought you were. Orri, I can hear you, I'm Dele. Can we talk to you, I'm Dele. Orri, we can hear you. Orri, we can hear you. I want to run Bafunanya. The great is answer. You better. I think you can hear you the lato tongiga. I be do kuna fi ni the laborado ano. Manoro la can hear you with the lato tongiga. Makana yon adon ka batana adon ya keji te yon with the lekaraka. Hmm. Eku kumeku kumeku. Ekukumeku,ekukumeku,ekukumeku,ekukumeku,ekukumeku,ekukumeku,ekukumeku,ekukumeku,ekukumeku,ekukumeku,ekukumeku,ekukumeku,ekukumeku,ekukumeku,
be offloading today. And I have to be there. Present. To take stock. If not, issues might come out and I don't want that. Hey, don't patronize me. Don't do this. We both agree that we will spend the day together. Why the sudden change? I, it's not intentional. I mean, it, this is a circumstance beyond my control. I work for someone, you know that. I don't want to have issues with my boss. Please, let me go do my job. What? I was supposed to be at work too. But look at me, I'm here. Honey. What am I supposed to be walking without you? I know. But trust me, I would not waste time. Baby boy, come on. I will not waste time. Like when you do this work. Yeah, I know you like it. Okay, how long are you going to? Just two hours. I won't be long. Just two hours? You said just two hours, like it's just. Come on, two hours is a lot of time. It is not. Before I get to the office, it's already 30 minutes. And then do one or two. Come on, don't be like this. One hour, 30 minutes. Okay, one hour, 30 minutes. One hour, 30 minutes. <laughs> okay, honey, I gotta go. Hey, hey, go like that. Come on. Come on. Gotta go. Give me some sugar. I gotta go. Give me some sugar, baby. Give me some sugar. Oh, love, no good. Kill you. <laughs> Bye. All right, darling. I'm gonna miss you. Take care of yourself, baby. Oh, my God. I've been calling you for hours. You said you were going to be away for just two hours, but this is over five hours. Where have you been? I'm sorry. You're sorry? Sorry does not change anything here. You think you're just going to come here and say you're sorry? And, and that takes away everything? You think it's just make it right? I can explain. Of course you need to explain. Start talking. Where have you been since the last five hours? Let me hear it. You promised to give me time. Are you serious? What has time got to do with what we're saying right now? Where have you been since the last five hours? That's what I asked you. You promised that it's just going to be me and me alone. Right? <sighs> Reverse psychology. That's what you're doing, reverse psychology. You're trying to use reverse psychology with me. Well, it's not going to work. Whatever antics that you came with here, it's not going to work until you tell me where you have been since the last five hours. I want you to promise me that no one is ever going to take my place in your heart. Promise? Angel, what is wrong with you? You said I'm the best. You said I'm your better half. You said I'm everything to you. Same promise you made to me. I want you to reassure me. Promise? Am I getting the assurance? Of course I'm going to reassure you, but I just want you to understand that this does not change anything. Alright, you are going to tell me where you have been since the last five hours. Promise. I promise. So yes, can we start talking? Look, Angel, 
I am not ready for this prank, okay? I'm not ready for whatever you're doing right now. Come down here and tell me where you've been. Why are you calling me? If you have anything to say, come down here and say it. Look, Angel, listen to me. What did you say? Yes, you are. Look, listen to me. Whatever trick or prank you're trying to play here, I'm not finding it funny anymore. What is going on? Repeat what you said. Accident. What's her name? Angel. Angel is her name. Angel. Okay, yeah. How are you related to her? She, she's my fiance. Your fiance? Yes. Come with me. Oh.
It's me, let's go. Please, let's go. If it's all you can. Please, I beg you, don't, don't leave me. Please, we have a lot to do together. Our dreams. mercy on me. Forgive me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, please. Erica. Chuku Erica. I have forgiven you. Because you know I have always loved you so much. But I'm sorry. There is nothing I can do to help you now. What goes around will always Come around. And it's time for you to go till eternity. Yes. If I command you, your evil spirit of unforgiveness, in the name of Jesus, die in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. The battle has been won. Praise God. Hallelujah. Father, I will thank you. Thank you. The God Almighty will thank you. We glorify your awesome name, Father. You have proven to be the shield behind us. You have made a name for yourself. All glory to you, Father. Thank you in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. You have never failed your children. Family of God, please. I will never forgive you. Never. How could you kill your own sister and then have the nerve to marry her man? How could you? How? You disgust me. And you put me through all of this. The only reason I'm still leaving you is because you are incapable of using your legs. Once you regain that movement, I will throw you out of this house and put you in the gutters where you belong. Josh, please forgive. If not for anything, for the sake of our son. Like you said, I'm incapable of using my legs. Please, Pico, forgive her mercy. Please, please. I don't want anything to happen to our son. Please, I'm begging you. <laughs> human but to forgive is divine I know what she did was wrong but please forgive her we all sin against God and he forgives us be good man for the sake of your son forgive his mother oh forgive her she's not Please. Please. 
Josh, I'm sorry. Forgive me, please. I'm a new person now. I've changed. Please forgive me, oh. Please. It's okay. Please forgive me. Please give me what you forgive me, oh. It's alright. Please. Don't continue like this. Because of the baby, okay? You are forgiven. Love. 